Hello guys, I'm still waiting for the video I did to upload. Uh, I hope this stream doesn't buffer because it normally does if I'm uploading something. Um, and in the video, it says just about everything I, I want to say, but isn't that Jupiter an absolute fucking disgrace of a human being? I mean, when did she... Hi. Hi, Athena. Uh, hi, uh, Andy. Yeah, that's definitely Andy. Hi, Apple. Hi, um, Barb's. Um, how, hi, Mandy. Hi, Case, uh, Cassie. Um, hi. Um, oh, Clown. Yeah, Clown. Hi, love. Uh, hi, Rubber Dub. Yes, yeah, so, hi Patsy, hi Patsy, um, hi Danny, yeah, another one of the um, people who, you know, uh, Fatty can't stop talking about, uh, but the, the thing that gets me the most is how dare she, That that's what gets me, how dare she, because one thing I want people to know, these people are not talking on behalf of Tommy Robinson, right, they're not talking on behalf of him. He won't know what is going on, right? He he won't have a fucking clue because he's such an intelligent idiot. He thinks he can t trust people. Um, well, he either thinks or he doesn't care that people go around trolling other people and causing them harm. Um, which one it is? Um, hi, Patsy. Um uh, Dream Team, you can stay in the chat if you want, but I don't particularly like the games you've been up to with Veli. Um, uh, because you haven't changed, have you? Have you, Bri? You've not changed. What do, what do I have to do to get rid of you completely? Do I have to start making videos about Bri and um, Harvey again? Hmm? Yeah? Do, do, is that what I have to do, Bri? Yeah. Uh, William Jones. Hey, Wendy, can we talk? I think it's about time we do. William Jones, who are you? <laughs> don't uh, don't know who you are. William Jones. Um, so anyone that wants to come, come on and chat while I'm waiting for this bloody video to upload. Um, who is it? William Jones? I don't know anyone by the name of William Jones, but there's the, there's the link, William Jones. Uh, don't know you. Yeah, you know. No. I haven't got a clue, William. No, no, don't come at me, um, Brian, with it's just YouTube, all right? Because it's not just YouTube when you've got Veli walking down uh, wherever he was uh, because you said, you said you'd meet him there and Veli goes to meet you there and lo and behold, Brian doesn't turn up again. So it's not just YouTube, is it? Okay, so William William has indeed arrived. Oh. Hey, Wendy. Oh, I recognize. Yeah, you do. Hey. Think about it. Hey. Is that Ashley? Hey. Yep, that's who the fuck it is, Wendy. Hey. So, okay then, Ashley. What can I do for you? <laughs> <laughs> You can't do you can't do shit. It's just been a long time. Long time. I ain't talked to you. So I need to talk to you, man. How you been? I caused you a lot of trouble. Did I, did I, did I cause you a lot of trouble, Wendy? Yeah, what you did to me Or did your mouth cause you a lot? Of, if I did did I cause you a lot of yeah, bye. Too loud. Sounds like a daycare. Um, 
So hi guys. <laughs> hi, Wendy. You what, love? I said hi. it sounds like a daycare. Well, it did, didn't it? And it, it wasn't perfect for him to come online. Sounds and, like a nursery uh, school. After all, I, I'm the one that supposedly caused it. No, that's the one. You know when they got those clips of me saying the N-word, right? It was him who set that lie at that whole argument off. So why he wanted to talk to me, I, I do not know. Um, he uh, made a massive lie. Cool. Um, so, yeah, he can go He can go and swivel. I'm not interested. He did it. So oh. I really don't care in anything. And we got Trill as well. I'm just waiting for the, a video I made um, to, to upload. Stop, Trilla. But, um, uh, so, uh, Andy, what, what do you I think like. about... That's not Trilla. Yeah, oh, that's me. Andy. Yeah. Yes, Wendy. To that, to that yeah. Wendy. Don't get paranoid. Yeah, carry on. I think carry I've on. got a lie because of what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. You got a massive lag, um, Wendy. Yeah, like I'm listening to you on. previously. Uh, you got a massive lag. I know, but I, I expected it. Trill it, shut up. So oh. anyway, um, Andy, what on earth? Yes, Andy, Wendy. What on earth has caused Jupiter, Jupiter to come out with all of this rubbish about you? Well, there seems to be there seems to be a timed attack going on. It's not just Jupiter. We've got Ginger Tony on her YouTube as well as you've got Dave Smith. And then you, you've got them on Telegram all at the same time. And it's not just on myself and Clown. It's on you. It's on Mandy. It's on everyone else that's spoken against Tommy. And then magically today, and a post came out about Tommy and the Rape of Britain. So you talked about a lot of names that are literally against each other. Yep. What? Fighting for right. the same cause? No. The smear campaign. Right? In... So I just want to... I just Trilla. addressed it. Trilla. Trilla, wait, I did. Basically, it's a smear campaign. A smear campaign has been targeted so, against all those on, that have been you... known to speak out. Who are, who are you, public annoyance? Who are you? Have I just someone that you? had a lot of dealings with Team Tommy in the past with protests? So have, I, have, I, have I have I have I talked to you before? Who are you? Exactly? We've spoken before on live stream. Yes, I pr I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you know who I am. I was going to say. I'm gonna find I know what, but I don't know much about you, so Trillia. you don't know much. You don't need to. Yeah. Right. I'm just okay. trying to. Trillia, uh, you're not coming yeah. on here to take over. I am I'm just shit. introducing myself. Oh. When... Yeah. Okay, Trilla. Right. Yeah. We're used Trilla, to coming on live streams, yeah, and we're used to people trying to distract what the live stream's going. I'm to be about. not distracting. And you hours. coming on here and talking, it hours, makes it look like you hours, have come here hours, yeah. on an order. By the same people that have been smearing it, it, us. It's quite naive to assume that I'm trying well, to. Well, instead of just jumping in and taking the show for yourself, how about you sit back, watch so it, and enjoy it and research what it shared? We've got the whole month, we've got the whole year to talk about everything. So carry on. Well, then let's so wait. When you next, that like when the, seats, why don't so we watch? No exactly. So, well said. Kathy, you, you carry on talking shit where you, you know. I don't want to do it. You're 10 seconds or whatever. Yeah. Okay. I'd say moot him for now, Wendy. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> Trilla, come back later. Uh, he's gone. Um, so, what what did you say at the end there? What, what have they done today? It's... They made a documentary or something? Or something's come out today? Well, it's like a smear campaign's been put out on all those that have been known for speaking out about Tommy. And his dealings, and also the expose we've done on his rape of Britain, and also regarding his new one that he still hasn't put out like he promised. And obviously, he can't put it out because he knows that yes. it's already been exposed. Yes. So, for some reason today, but there's what been targeted I'm attacks. Is what, what's in my head is what? I don't know. I honestly don't know. <laughs> I woke up today so, with people sending me links at YouTube of people posting about us. It's like, what the hell was going on? Why are they suddenly targeting us again while crying online about us targeting them? Yeah, and what has Jupiter got to do with it? I don't know. Uh, 
maybe because I came on one of her live streams, you know, that first time to post the Rape of Britain and you guys played the Rape of Britain exposed version that we've done. That's yeah. the only reason I yeah, believe that Jupiter right. has an issue with me because she didn't like the way I made the video. She completely ignored the context and picked on how I made the video. Oh yeah, I mean we've all we've all um, kind of been um, targeted yeah. in her words um, because we disagree with God Himself, Tommy Robinson. Um, about yeah. a certain um, case in Telford. And because we it, disagree with that, everything's being brought up now. Yeah. I was kind of it, I mean, it's weird. that... Um, all I was going to say, Andy, is I was, I was trying to... I'm kind of disgusted that they brought up your children and everything like that. You know, considering that Jupiter has a son that uh, actually did beat who, his children who, up, who did that? it who amazed me. Who brought up his children? Who? See, I didn't actually Should know I'll that. I'll give you this last chance, right? Wait, I, right, I'll, I'll give you a chance. question. What, what, what did I do wrong? I asked the question. Who Jupiter, brought up his Jupiter children? did. Jupiter did. Right. Jupiter so why did. Why are you right? jumping Jupiter on me did. for asking a genuine question? Don't talk What's to me that? like this is not my channel. Don't talk, do that. Please just what are you talking? go on mute. Let's just, let's just watch, yeah, you know, Trilla. Off, you know, let's you know. just watch. You don't appreciate who the fuck you're talking to. Fuck yourself, dickhead. Right, I think I've got a delay, so bear with me here. I actually didn't yeah. know that was played yeah. out again oh. on the stream. Sorry, I'll wait for you to speak. Right, so... They, they brought that up again um, today about your children. But what made me absolute laugh, why, right, was um, the fact that Jupiter actually has a son who did beat up her children. Um, and yet she was talking about you and saying things about you. And it's come from nowhere, Andy. It's literally this attack on you and Mandy and Athena and myself for some strange reason. And clown world is literally from out of the blue. So there must be something one of you knows, right, that they don't want out there. Yeah, the, I mean, I, I know bits and bobs of what's not been put out there, and it's been withheld for a reason because they want everything that we've got out in public so that they can paint a narrative over it. So we and obviously clown world is dripping the information out in his own time he feels you know it needs to be put to shut tommy down they keep going on about like hell guy that we should just put it all out right all out and you know it's like yeah you want us to put everything out so that you can quickly shut it all down no one pays interest when you put it all out in one go you drip the information out and share it and drip it out and share it. People will soon get it drained into their heads. But we're not forcing anyone to believe in what we're saying. We're sharing voice notes of their own, videos of their own, links and screenshots of like the EDL company's house, all the Rape of Britain stuff. We're sharing it all in our channel. Everything we make in our videos is depicted and shared on the channels. So anyone that claims anything we do is cut and shut, the original is on the channel, Public Annoyance. Unlike what they've yeah. done towards yeah. me and my, my past and coming up and back my daughter, obviously Jupiter, it's rectified something in her past and it made her angry. Instead of her taking it on her son, she used that anger and passion to make it out on me. But this has been going on for three years. It originally started with Danny Roscoe posting an 18-second yes. voice clip and basically cutting the rest out. But silly Ginger Tony posted the full voice note out on her channel, which basically, if anyone's heard the rest of it, I mean, anyone can find it. You can hear the whole entire situation I had with social services and the police. But Right. That's up to the audience. So, I mean, so they can... it's, it's... Yeah, the, Andy, I, this is what this is what's baffling me, right? 
it was already out there about about your um, personal problems that had been put out there okay so why on earth drag it up today well, we think it's something to do with the episode five rape of Britain. They're, they're kind of stuck in a situation where we've already exposed it and they can't put it out because it'll make them look stupid. But I don't know. Maybe they've got to the point all they can do now is just slander, slander, slander and in their anger that we've ruined their whole entire rape of Britain episode. You know, you've seen the attacks. You, anyone that speaks to us or seems to be speaking to us will also get attacked. And you're a witness to that. Oh, and quite a lot of people um, in the chat. Look, since I've started talking, yeah, since I've started talking to you guys and, you know, I, I talked to Mandy and Athena and, and mostly it's not even about um, Robinson or any of them. So this is where I get confused because they seem to think that you guys are talking about them 24 hours a day every day that's not the case no. but they they there's something they're scared of because they've done this well i've made a video and i posted it on my channel it's just under 10 minutes long it's about the blackmail between tommy robinson and danny tomo that tommy leaked the daily mail yeah i'm uploading it's currently uploading it. Yeah. On my thing and that, that's why I, w I was a bit late and i'm waiting for it you know what it well, can be like andy i found yeah, that more than when, interesting to be honest well clown world originally released those voice notes and i put in you know what else do they know about the blackmail regards to tommy robinson obviously he did something on danny roscoe to the daily mail but then told or zach walton told clown world to pull a certain photo off the channel which was of Danny Tomo and that Lisa. But with what happened with Danny Tomo with yes. his wife at the time, you know, that, I mean, do I need to explain myself with what I believe? You know, there's a charge sheet from the actual police to prove that, you know, he did abuse physically his wife and blamed Lisa for it. But the question is, as you know, there's a rumor going on about a 15 year old. I've heard from three different people and yes, every story yes. of what they've seen is the same as what Mandy's put out on YouTube. And one of them being a guy called Vinny Sullivan. Right. Who has oh, turned against right, me. Oh, right. Okay, so he said it too. Yep. Right. Hell Goa has already stated that, that she took... Yeah, it's me. Yeah, so basically, Helgoa stated, we've got it somewhere, I need to dig this up, that she managed to get the phone back off Finney Sullivan that was taken off Danny Tomo on a protest, which I witnessed to. The same day Danny Tomo was getting grilled by Tracy Blackwell on video. Oh, Danny Tomo was attacked by yeah. SED members in regards to Nonsen, a 15-year-old. And I'll say no more that the videos come from that phone. And one of the videos was of Danny Tomo sending a so wanking I'm video to that Lisa. And the other video is the one that you hear rumours of online that Mandy's getting attacked for. So, but yeah, if these, video, if these video, oh, videos exist, right? What's their problem? You, can, you, you can't <laughs> deny facts, can you? So They're involved what's with the cover Why can't they? they go about it in a normal manner? Because they're probably more involved in it than what they want us to believe. Right, uh, Danny Roscoe, I don't know why you're over here. Yeah, you just like Danny. He has like, to be. Yeah. Fame. Um, can I add a few things? So basically, the chronologically, if we put this together, I appear on your stream like a couple of days ago, isn't it? We did uh, mention something about the uh, rape of Britain Five, and we did have me, uh, me and you, Wendy. We did have a quick uh, catch up about it. We had um, a chit chat. 
Yeah. yeah. So basically, they are obviously they're watching a, like a hoax. Um, what is the happening is now because the light, the last the the, the rape of Britain one two three, which obviously been exposed by Andy Atina Mandy. Um, what the, that started with sixteen or eighteen hundred people coming into that demonstration to watch this actually in Telford live on the screen. Now after this exposure, basically this uh, the rape of Britain two lost a lot of uh, people coming in, and I was like I think four or six hundred, and then or maybe eight hundred, and the last one, the uh, episode three, got only two hundred people basically in the Telford. So. Tommy obviously lost uh, lost the interest. Well, people lost their interest to his uh, the Republican uh, one, two, three, four, and five. Um, he needs he literally needs to release their number five. However, he can because there are reasons. He did uh, in latest couple of days. He was uh, plugging in on his uh, Telegram channel uh, poll, and he was asking if the British people wants to actually see this live on the screen in the Telford. He was plugging this every single day, a couple of times a day, and he only, I think, got 3,000 votes, where 90% been basically positive that they want to see it. That was his, um, he was literally checking the, checking the grounds before actually he made the decision if he wants to do it again in the Telford or he will just release this online. Now, we all know that with every single situation like that, there will be donation campaign because he will need money for the screen. Um, he will never ever release any financial statement, how much he actually gained money, how much it costed him and how much actually he got extra left. Now, they all know that there are people out in there like yourself, like Athena, like Mandy, like Andy, like me, who will be obviously watching it. And uh, if there will be any lies putting down in there, we are going to expose this. Now, they know exactly they can't highlight and they can't publish this uh, documentary because there's already lots of information in there online about the, his um, uh, stars in his uh, documentary. They they know exactly they can't get anywhere if we are around. And that was, the I think, one of the reasons they come out all of a sudden. There was like synchronized attack from lots of different angles, from lots of different YouTube channels today, started today morning. And then afternoon, very late afternoon, Tommy Robinson announced then he is going to put this The Rape of Britain 5 on the screens live in the Telford on the 27th of January. So it's all basically coming towards... In, is around that basically that announcement, doesn't it? So can I, I really add, believe... can I just say this though? I actually didn't know Jupiter did or said anything in regards to me because I only caught the end of the stream where she posted Dr. Pugh. Yeah. It was only when well, she kind of me. Yeah. That's what she believes. But, she but it was only until when did she mention talking about my child? I only, I honestly didn't know. So he caught me off yeah, guard with asking me that one. I mean. Oh, sorry, yeah. Oh, I am sorry, Andy. I didn't mean to oh, do sorry, that. That's not your fault. I mean, I, I honestly didn't know. Right, she did a stream called "Oh, something um, old-fashioned um, values don't count anymore," or something like that. And lo and behold, it's still up. By the way, Andy, um, yeah. it was about you. Yeah. Smith, Smith uh, why in, she it? did that? Why she chose to do that? Yeah. And I, the the what I found, like I said, what I found hysterical was the fact what she has going on in her, in her, on her in her own family, and and that she should try to be lying and be little you, um, for that when everybody hypocrites. knows about when it. They're all hypocrites. It's the same with APW Antifa Public Watch. Lee Shears, he's been sharing the same thing about my daughter and it turns out he has actually a court note up against him in 2014 banned from seeing his wife and child because of his physical mental abuse and there's him posting accusing me of doing what he's been doing and you've got like you said jupiter oh. then you've got danny roscoe you got danny, danny roscoe well, too who originally did the yeah. cut and shut They're always accusing everyone else of, being, of this, exactly what they're doing. Yeah, but Dan, yeah, don't you think Danny, Danny Roscoe, Roscoe, yeah, hypocrite. Is... Sorry. Don't, don't you um, 
think that Danny Rothko is a fool. I mean, he wants a he wants a revolution in this country. He <laughs> encourages people to <laughs> storm Downing Street and to storm the House of Commons. You know, the man's an idiot. I'm sorry, I, I just can't take. Well, it Wendy, seriously. I'm hearing a rumor that Danny Rothko did a live stream with Dave Smith talking about wanting to employ some white men to go and attack RAF Scampton, where the illegals have been helped. Now, I'm wanting to see if someone has got a recording of this because that is worth putting straight to police. Oh, yeah. I mean, I don't know. I I haven't heard it. Uh, I didn't hear it. But um, knowing Dave... I've heard from three um, different people. One said there was recording. They're trying to get hold of it. There's someone called Kazmak on Twitter saying that she's seen it. She's the one who originally told me about it. I mean, she's another one who gave me some information on Team uh, Tom in the past, and she got attacked as well. I don't well. know. I know there was something going on between. Yeah, I know there was something that they did have a long talk, those two. Uh, I don't know if, if that was actually said, but it wouldn't surprise me if it was, um, because Ross mm. goes very good. Because actually, I think it might have been said, and then he was arrested uh, when he was, I don't know, he was somewhere in London and he got arrested. And Dave took the street, took streams down and closed his Twitter as well because I think Dave got a bit scared. Yeah. Why? <laughs> if they truly believe in this own action and conviction, they shouldn't be taking anything down, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But they've all blocked this from their channels but and they they're don't. all speaking about this on their channels. You know, they're all fascists, they're all communist supporting, claiming to be patriots. They are basically doing the work for the idiots that are causing the issues we've got in this country. You know, government, government wants to implement their solutions. They need a problem. So, you know, Tommy is their problem to the public. What legislations can we put in place using Tommy? I know, it's banned protesting. The whole EDL thing, the, the memorial, you know, the cenotaph thing, that whole thing was just set up. Yeah, so well, everybody's I mean, sacked. That whole thing it was so staged. I think there's a lot of people in this country who are already seeing it, and that, that's where he's losing his support, and that's where he's shaking. He's coming out with the new avenues, trying to find out the new break breakthrough, and he literally can't. So what they're going to do, they're trying to silence everyone who speaks against him, just because maybe he, maybe they believe that we are the reasons why he can find the breakthrough. All that money he's took, yeah. What solutions has he ever come up with in this country or for this country? He's not come up with a single solution. No. No. He did. Spain. Not one, Andy. Not one. <laughs> so, I know what what is what is our worth to be following someone who doesn't give solutions but takes I mean, donations? You know. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. talking sure. about the eleventh of November, the Patriots were going to go down there anyway. They didn't need Tommy Robinson to be saying anything um, because. Ordinary um, page patriots were going to go down there, there anyway. They don't need Tommy Robinson anymore. He's not needed. He's not wanted. He doesn't do anything. I can't no, think of one thing he's done. You had a wee uh, group of like 200 like EDL looking guys that were in EDL, probably hardcore EDL. You had Tommy who was video at the forefront of that crowd. And then you had a camera at the back where the police were getting attacked. The whole thing just looked so set up. Honestly, it just looked uh, and to think that I used to be there on those protests and in not realise that. In fact, Andy, when I think about but the guy who who stupidly after um the the, the dongs finished right at eleven o'clock and the silence started singing Rue Britannia, right? He was he was actually like standing near Robinson. So um mm. That didn't shock me. Now, I see what you're saying about it being a setup where, you know, where he's concerned. But don't you yeah. agree that he, he didn't even have to go there because ordinary patriots and ex-army would have been, been there anyway to make sure that everything went the way it should? You don't need the oh, likes of Robinson yeah. turning up. I mean, what's the other thing? No. Well, you know, it was either he was used or two, he wanted to be on the scene show you know to give the public i am here i do care about you 
and then disappear again, do his thing, and then do another. It's, it's, but I, honestly, with what I know, with the connections with Home Office and XMI five agents, I'm, I'm telling you, I believe Tommy Robinson is a plant. He's a state activist plant. Hundred percent. Oh, look. And you got hope, not hate. Uh, I, they need Tommy. Without I Tommy, there are no one. He works for the state. I, yeah. Yeah. I believe for a long time that he works for the state. On it, actually. It's just more and more evidence is coming up on it, Wendy. You know, it's like we keep saying things. You know, what are they linked to? Certain people and that stuff that Andy Tate with trafficking come out, and it's like, holy shit. And you got hotel rooms, Paul Golden, and the Edge, and victims getting drugged up. And you got these rooms of videos with survivors, yeah. and you got you got admissions of Danny Tomo it hasn't been put public according to Hope and I Hate, but of Danny Tomo admitting that he had sexual intercourse with a survivor in Telford. Remember, he had his uh, devices seized. And, you know, Tommy claims to care about survivors and all that. Why did you not spoke out about Danny? And according to well, I've actually spoken to the father. Yeah, I've actually spoken to the father of um, said survivor, and he's not a happy man. I know one. I know one of the fathers too. Yeah. Mm. According to Tim mm. Tommy, the fact that he slept with the survivor it doesn't matter because that was consensual and she was adult at the time. So it's same with Jonathan Miller, isn't it? Hmm. But Naga. it does matter because, you know, they're not. Uh, yeah, we know that, I, but I because we are intelligent. Matter. I mean, maybe it's, I don't know. I think it's. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, they're, attract, they're because, attracting uh, all the victims who are wanting to put the stories out, aren't they? So, you know, that's a great way to groom girls and their attention. You know what the far right have been well known in EDL? Sexual intercourse, rape child pornography it's common as anything in edl you know i don't want to link it together i can't prove it but it doesn't look good from what i've seen with the tr stuff you know waking up and exposing the rape of britain was something but digging in digging in and watching their retaliations and their smear com campaigns when we talk about this stuff it just why are you getting so angry for just answer our flipping questions we wouldn't have got to this point well all they have to do is answer um, your questions and, 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 and then you can reply in a proper way and they can answer in a proper way. Yep. But they can't. It, they've always got to be no. trying to dox people or doing well, stuff to like, people. That time when I went on live stream with Jupiter on Banksy, she just went off on one, calling me a fascist and saying that I'm a narcissist, I'm against that. women. Yeah. Yep. And then you got Danny Roscoe. Then Jupiter muted me. And Danny was like, oh, you need to get proper live stuff or something i'm like jupiter's already admitted she muted me mate so why are you playing this game again you just don't want to debate me and when they do want to debate me it's got to be their questions and me answering i'm like hold on a minute it was me that was calling you all out let me do the questioning and then you answer but no 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 it's yeah. smear me smear me smear me don't let him speak Yeah, but everyone has the right to speak. Like, I mean, uh, okay, let's put it this way. Tommy Robinson, right, has the right to make his documentaries and do whatever, okay? But people also yeah. have the right to investigate it and see if it's all, if it's the truth or not. He said no, it himself. Him. He said it in his own post. Question everything, even everything that I post. That's in his own words. And I've done that. And I've been attacked, not just me, yourself, clown, everyone who's questioned has been attacked smeared and that word pedophile nonce abuse child abuse is the same crap from the same people who have the convictions of it or are they surrounded by those oh, kinds yeah i wonder why that is i wonder why there's so many of them around um because um even up in sunderland with that um justice for chelsea <laughs> yeah. didn't her father yeah. turn out to be um just yeah yeah tommy he also had sex with the course you, the victim as well, didn't he? oh i don't know did he i don't know if it was that 
was, I can't remember the name of the girl. That it was someone from up um, that end at the time of that. But yeah, what you're saying. Yeah. Um, so, what does Tommy do? You, so, do you guys think that Tommy knows what goes on online and what is said yeah. in all the Telegram groups and things like that? Yeah. Is he aware? Uh, I think he knows some of it because I've had a few responses from him myself with a soccer account. Where I played him talking about his team. Why do you allow your team to attack people? Ah, okay. Instead, he's told. I've got the voice messages on my channel. Right? You know, I can quite easily send them to you. I played him, and he gave his answer. He said he's told his team to stop feeding them trolls, as in me, Crown World, and anyone else questioning Tommy. Yeah. And basically, stop feeding them, but they won't listen to me. You know, so we don't know whether Tommy has got rid of Team Tommy because of this issue, or whether Tommy's just using them. As a distraction, we don't know. He's using them. They're well, doing exactly what. It's probably the latter. But the funny thing yeah. is, Wendy, yeah. I have this conversation with Clown quite a lot. Yeah, every time they go on the attack on us, there's always something about to come out of the TR. But every time they attack us, they put the spotlight on us, and to me, that's a ticket to say thank you. Right, this is what I've got on them, and this is why they want to put the spotlight on me. You know, I'm not forcing people to believe the stuff that I hear. They're just trying to shut me down from having that free opinion on my channel. And I've posted every conversation, every question and their responses. And I've been doxxed. They've attacked my boss. Yeah. They've sent multiple, I mean, over 40 emails to my ex-employer, which I've posted the proof on my channel. That was Ginger Tony, Danny Roscoe under... Uh, Muslim name or an Asian name, and you got Helgoa under a name of Wendy, believe it or not. Email. I put all these emails out. Oh, on my oh right. Yeah, sending send messages, voice notes, yeah, cut messages. Like, I'm a child mm -hmm. abuser. I had it all sent to my employer. And my boss, I already told my boss what had already happened with Team Tommy before I started with him. And I told him my situation about wanting to move out of London, and that's why. I went for the job in Felixstowe because I was living in London at the time and so I was close to Team Tommy. But... So, so is, is this not... Could you not go to the police about it or did you not want to, Andy? Uh, I reported Lee Garrett for putting out my daughter's name because she was under the age of 13 and my ex's name, yeah. the mother of my daughter. Uh, I also had let the police know about Ginger Tony turning for my work and the AOU channel threatening about putting orders of pedophilia and nonce outside my work. Oh, right. Okay. Did they but do all anything? I could do is... All I, yeah. Well, no. It's all, they, what we've learned there, yeah, they will tell you what they can't do and what they wish to do. All they do is create content yeah. and drama, and they like the attention. And what they do and hope for is that their followers and supporters will do the dirty work that they can't do. Can I just address Well, that's the way it's coming across, and, and Jupiter like yeah. it. You what? Um, yes, of course you can. Sorry. Yeah. Danny Roscoe. Um, you did make a comment. You hate this left wing Marxist Jews, just exactly like uh, Marx. Yeah, you are right. Um, Dan Roscoe, you're all behaving like a leftist, far left trolls, like a uh, fascists. Um, the only person who is a left wing Marxist in here is you and your fantastic team of uh, from Team Tommy. That's only you. You all attack, you all dox, you all try threaten, blackmail, and just to silence people because you don't like the truth about yourself coming out. So. How about you'll just find yourself a different hobby and just disappear? I'll quickly add to the end of that, we can prove everything that you just said because we've got them doing it on their own channels, doxing us, mm -hmm. emailing us, telling them that they're going to the police, reporting us for defamation. They've done everything that they've accused us of. Mm. But yeah, the only thing exactly. that we Do haven't we, got uh, that they've got is the uh, numbers. And they're hoping that their numbers is what will silences but you know three and a half years later on Wendy 
as you know yourself, we're still here, still talking. They can accuse us, they can yeah, do us. I, I know. They can yeah. us, threaten us, all they like. We're still here. Well, exactly. They and they have tried everything. Tyrant Finder is is he friend or foe? <laughs> oh, I, I'm 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 here because I'm I'm Hello, being Tyrant. mentioned. Good evening, Hello, everybody. Chris. Hello. I, I um, what am I as a complete outsider that happened to stumble across this by complete accident? Because I started a YouTube channel when I had cancer. Okay, love. You no. Know, um, Sorry. Oh, sorry. I, yeah, I, I, I'm, you, you know, I'm being mentioned in the chat by Danny. I've seen videos by Danny calling me there because Mandy donated money to me. I've gone woke and I do all their bidding by attacking people. Oh, that's where really? I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you. Yeah, I know you. you I yeah. swear I've heard your name. Yeah, clown knows okay, me. Man. Public knows me. It's about time I said why I well, went to Ireland. Ireland. OK, it's not going to I'm not going to sit okay. down and shut up or Danny Roscoe sits there and calls me a woke lefty, you know, do good on you, Chris. Fucking good on you, man. Right. Danny, the reason why I shut up and gone silent is because I have a family. OK, and the threats that comes with it. So I had to protect my family. OK, I didn't do it because yeah. Mandy yeah. brought me a laptop. She replaced the damaged laptop because she saw that I was doing it for the people and not grifting just for the fame and fortune. I don't give a toss about my YouTube channel. If it went tomorrow, it would be fine. But it's the threats. And do you know why I got those threats? It's because I called you out for sniffing coke on the first one. Rape of Britain demonstration. Danny, you got to remember... I worked in an industry that can tell somebody when they're pinned straight away. I'm not scared of what I've done in the past. I was a senior custody officer, right? I'm trained in shit like that. You were pinned, and I called you out for it. You didn't like you it. And that's why that I got, yeah, and I put a video out about it because yeah. you started attacking Mandy Mosley, you know, claiming that... that um, you, you, you know, she's not blind in everything, so that's why. But it's also other things, Danny. It was a bit funny. You then subsequently went on and done a video, a live stream of somebody saying that I get sixty to one hundred and twenty thousand views on a live stream, earn thousands of pounds, right? But it's it's funny. It's absolutely <laughs> hilarious now. That I've been investigated by the benefit agency. And do you know what? Do you know something that the investigating officer told me? Is that I get between 60 and 120,000 views, which was quite bizarre because I've never got 60 to 120,000 live views at any one time. So where does it all come from, Danny? Basically, they report to you. Yeah. Well, I can't they, prove that. Exactly I, can't prove I, I can't. I can't prove nothing. Danny Rosco, I can prove everything of what we're saying. How about that, Danny Rosco? You also did want to see me um, for a paint, and you turn up ninety minutes later. Um, Danny Rosco, in your place, I would just disappear. Seriously. Someone who can't you. even talk about his original name, eh? Got a lot to hide with that original name, Scott Tomlin. Yeah. Anyway, uh, Tyrant Finder, I just want to say well done for uh, coming out finally um, about this, what they tried to do to you. It's, I, fed up. I, I, feel, I don't know if I'm too loud or anything, if, if it's coming through too loud. It, no, you're I fine. You're this. fine, love. Fine. I, I started this channel back just before lockdown. You know, I was in Dover. I met, it's, it's so funny, right? What I, what I did really find out is, is what I found within what, what you're calling the grifting movement, people are only surely doing it for likes, views, because all I hear Danny Roscoe going on about is how many views he's had on a video. Shit exactly. me. You shouldn't be doing it for views, mate. You should be doing it, hopefully, getting out there. Right? Not yeah, mentioning actually. the views. That's, that's not, you know, why people do it. That's why, you know, I didn't say, I don't care. I mean, you know, I don't care how many views I get. 
along in. Well, when he boxed my uh, boss's name out in a voice with DFDS, who I was pulling trailers for, right? He put out something about me not having live streaming equipment, like he was jealous that I can do videos or something. It's like I'm not even a flipping YouTuber or a live streamer. I'm a truck driver. I just made that's videos jealous. to expose your scum. That's it. I'm just a nobody truck driver. That's it. But he has to pick out and try and put out a attack that's personal. But it's a problem is, and I, I and I expect the team Tommy have tried to do all the digging and all the research on me. <laughs> you ain't finding nothing, nothing on me, nothing. They, can't they can do a research. They can research. <laughs> the least she can research. I can tell you that. That's why they've been exposed quicker because they've done it themselves on their own channels to their own yeah, audience. Danny, that's that's all you got to come. Danny, Danny, I find people right that that try to portray when they're called pe people pedophiles, they call people nonces and things like that. They are portraying their own guilt. Okay, I, I, why do why does everyone got to bring up you know the w whatever public annoyance his past was? Okay. Whatever he's done, he you know, he's done. He may be sorry for it. Who knows? Okay, it's what he's standing for now, right at this very minute. It's not standing with a baby basher. Okay, Danny, I went to the first rape of Britain, and that was the only one they got me to because I seen you coming out of there absolutely pinned on coke and goodness knows what. And then a few, few days later, a video came out with actually people sniffing coke on the march national exactly. national it was patriotic alternative crowd they had at the rate yep. of britain as well uh, for victims and survivors who are abused by people who take fucking drugs the victims and survivors been given drugs as well what happened to them and... what happened to marie waters after that gone they are hypocritical oh, yeah. lying grifters to be, to be quite honest, as well, uh, and to be called a lefty, you, you know what I mean? I had a lot, a lot of the same views. I was being sucked into the whole Tommy, Tommy, Tommy thing. Until um, I actually <laughs> seen it, really. To be quite honest, right, I'm a complete outsider because, you know, I wasn't really interested in the likes of the EDO. I wasn't even watching the internet then. I didn't even know what the EDO was. I wasn't fucking interested in it. I've never been same. part of that movement, right? It's just I stumbled in on it because... I was becoming popular. People were listening to me because they saw me. I, I, I was for everybody. Yeah. But then you was on the forefront of your live streams. We see what you was about, you know, there's that time with the veteran getting pushed over with the police, you know. You made a mark for yourself standing up against it. Mm. But this is what Danny Roscoe is jealous about because there's not one video of him doing anything out of passion. It's all for glory, it's all for fame, it's all for numbers and subs. Do you know Look the day, down a megaphone. Do you, do you know do you know the real truth? I wouldn't really stand up. You know, I'm a shy person. You know, I won't I won't come on camera now. I, I'm only ever good when I've actually got a camera because that's my crutch, that's my barrier. Okay. Yeah. You know that day that I, I led everyone down um off of off of um the cenotaph because we weren't and Ginger Tony and everyone was there. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. yeah. I was there. I stood up and I said that I shit my brick, but I had to do it because I felt passion inside that, me. Yeah, it's, it's I know that I'm feeling very well, you know. You can't withhold yourself. You know what's right and what's wrong and you have to tell, tell it out, you know. It's what everyone should be doing. You see something that you wouldn't want done to yourself or your kids or anyone that you're close to, you should be calling it out whether it's done to a stranger or someone close. You know, the more people that do it, the less criminals there'll be. Because if you stay silent when you see something done on someone that you wouldn't like done to yourself or your own kids and stay silent, it gives them a ticket to keep doing it. Yeah. And that's what Team Tommy have been doing to anyone that questions their motives, their agendas of what Tommy's been doing. And we are the proof in the pudding that we've allowed to be abused and exploited for our own personal lifestyles to be put publicly and show publicly what these people are. We've basically proved to the world that they are exactly what they accuse Antifa of. Well, that's as they've doxed is... publicly. You know, they've done everything that they accuse the left of doing. Well, it, 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 <laughs> it, they do. Uh, they, uh, 
it was it all stems from the time you know you know i i seen it it was like the whole freedom movement okay they were all there in september 2020 because they were all trying to take over the freedom movement but the likes of kate shiramani because you you know you had somebody there i can't remember her name now she was uh um um bnp british national party somebody or other they were trying to take over uh, but they they didn't want them all involved, so they pushed them all off the stage. Yeah, it was like they, they call them the far right. I don't know what their, the business is of the far left, far right, whatever it is. It's the same bird in my, in my, division. In my opinion. Division. It's, it's division. They were trying to take over that thing because they knew at the time, mm. I, I think, it was going to be a big money earner. And the likes mm. of and it's improvement with the likes of Kate Shiromani, you know, she had over sixty thousand pounds in donations donated for a court case that we never really heard about. You know, we know other people like that, don't we? Mm. <laughs> That's what you like to think, though. Yeah, um, Tommy Robinson. You know, and going down to Tommy Robinson's last arrest for not leaving the area. Now, I find this mighty suspicious because. When he went for a bell variation, alleged bell variation, yet on any court list, anybody can search court listings. And he wasn't on any court listings that for that day to get any sort of bell variation so he could enter London, to, you know. Um, I couldn't find it. I then heard on his live stream his solicitor drop a minute saying, it might, you know, um, I can't believe we weren't on the list. And if you hear that on Mayor Tuesday's live stream, it clearly says that, that even his solicitor wasn't aware, you know, he should have been on the list, but wasn't. Oh. But, then, but then why would you go for a bail variation? Because technically it's what they call the offence that he was arrested for, was a summary only offence. So it would only ever be done in the magistrate court anyway. It's a summary only. It's, it's basically, he was given a dispersal notice and refused to disperse. Yeah. So what was money, the charge? Money, money. So money, what was money, the charge? Money. So if he was actually taken to court for that, why does Tommy need under the pounds worth of barristers when he can technically well, he get done, any, he used it. Well, he used any criminal Yeah, but any criminal charges you're granted legal aid anyway. Mm -hmm. But why would you fight your what, what but why would you then go to Crown Court to fight for bail variations which would money only on a summary only offence? You you know, so to me, I, he was the only court okay, list I, the, the only court list I found him on was the pre the last one. He was on that court <laughs> list. Um but previous ones to that I couldn't find him at all, the, the very first one. So you know, I uh, uh, I, I don't know what to say anymore. He's inventing. He's literally inventing um, um, things which, yeah, things which not happening or never happen. He's literally changing the image. He uh, he's stating he putting as a proof that he need the money for his um, court defense. He he putting some email, but anyone can roll the email to anyone. Yeah. Um, he's withdrawing the basic details of the actually who sent him this email or which solicitor were even the first name. Um, and then he asking for more money and more money and more money. And that is 70% of this, his latest uh, begging for donations was literally false, based on the false facts. Um, if you can find him on the listing, that means the court case is not happening. We did actually quote him a few times on um, stating that he will be going to the court, but there was no listing for his case. And, um, you know, but he was literally triggering the donation campaign. So... Like I said, whoever is paying him is, is absolutely foolish, isn't it? But it's up to people what they want to do with their money. But uh, clown, clown, yeah, clown. You know that day he was arrested the last time in the in the um, yeah. coffee bar or wherever he was. Yeah, to me that yeah. all seemed like a setup. To me, it was just too of course, pit of course. Pat. If you of know course. what I mean, so dragged out in front of everyone. I mean, could you, so you could ran you away in Chinatown just before the police trapped all the crowd in. 
Yeah, that oh, was yeah. Uh, 11th, isn't it? That was 11th. Mm. The Chinatown was 11th. But he was uh, arrested all when he went for this Jewish uh, yeah. demonstration. So he was oh, told yeah, by yeah, the yeah, Jewish yeah. organization not to attend because they did not wish to see him in there. He went in there. He was warned. He went into discussions with uh, with police officers in the, in the pub. And then the uh, superintendent came in. And the superintendent, uh, at some point, he lost his uh, temper. And he told him exactly, listen, if you were going there, that's it. You're going to get arrested. Section this and that. Done. Now he knew exactly. He, the point is with Tommy Robinson is he spent so much time in the Spain, uh, you know, sniffing coke and spending lots of money, you know, which he earned in past um, on um, the cheapest prostitutes, as um, everyone is claiming. All the all the uh, witnesses. Um, he spent all the money, and then he come back. He he needed money, so he was triggering the campaign. He was triggering the campaign from Spain. He didn't get any money. So that's where he said, he decided, oh, he has to come back to the Britain because obviously no one want to pay him um, when he's sitting in the Spain. He came back to Britain. He was trying to uh, trigger the lots of different campaigns. Now, if you will look on this, of these campaigns which he's triggering now, and if you will look into the past, they are very, very similar to each other. He literally he, he copy and paste the same thing. He knew exactly when he will be arrested, and this the the all arrests which has to happen. There has to be spectacle uh, arrest. There has to be so much drama. There has to be so much fighting. There there has to be so many police officers in there, because only that way he can push people to actually pull out the the wallets and start paying him again. Is this is all for the donation purposes? So why would you need a king's but tank sword to fight a summary only offence? Why would you need a barrister? Because it seems very serious. <laughs> it sounds very serious, but uh, it what, sounds obviously 35, expensive. Section 35 <laughs> summary yeah. only offence that would only be yeah. dealt with in a magistrate's court. Yeah. What, it is a big thing, isn't it? <laughs> for him. It's and desperation for money, um, that is. Didn't, uh, didn't James Goddard have something? Hang on, guys. Didn't James Goddard have something like that where he couldn't enter London? But I, I don't remember him going mm. to the, the high court. No, no, <clears throat> no. He had five years, I think. Five years ban on entering the London. I think he's ending in 2024, I think. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 and I find it really weird, right? It's, it's like... Tommy Robinson got arrested that day then automatically got banned from the whole of London. Yet, you, you know, you had the whole truth movement going on, you know, marching the streets throughout lockdown, allowed to do what they wanted to do, the leaders of their groups. And they never got a ban from London when they got arrested. Mm. Which, you know, mm. it's, to me, it's, it was to me, it was to paint a narrative and to be replaced mm. on on Twitter just after what happened, it, it was, to me, it's all too convenient. And a lot more dots. Set, well, it, it's getting on now. It, you know, I've, 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 I've had it put, you know, put to my attention. It's, this is all to do with the whole Sunak takeover of the government. Mm -hmm. And it was some sort of deal done with some, you know, country. You, you know, and it was it was soon to play, and Tommy has either been playing for a fool, or he's in on it. Yeah, it's starting to look yeah. like it to me, in my opinion, and it is just an opinion. Yeah. I mean, you've got your connections to the Home Office, you've got connections to XMI5, You've got Helgoa saying she's getting information, giving information. Self admitted it again today on Jupiter on a live stream chat. Yeah, but if going on to like the home office and get it, you, you know, when you're, you're, when you're in jobs, even ex, even service people, we've probably got service people in the chat, you know, they, they have to sign the Official Secrets Act. They get yeah. vetted and their family gets vetted. Yeah. We've got Helgoa, right? Son works exactly. for the home office. <laughs> right. He's 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 clearly signed the official secrets act, so his mm. family is clearly being checked out. So his mum's been checked out. So clearly, then she, what, what what links she, then of the Home Office put to Hell Gower to she Tommy was Robinson, a director of the EDL. Else? She was a exactly. director and companies else from the EDL. 
Exactly. So when people say that with docs their information, their information is actually public information. Well, it's not how, only how only the person the secrecy there. act. Yeah. Um, it, exactly. It is is it's not only the person they, they vet. They vet he, the family as well. Exactly. It, and he wasn't he wasn't a cleaner in there. He was a no. high ranking officer, lead of some of a manager of some sort of. You know, if if you're trying to apply to police, your whole family is going to be vetted. If you're trying uh, to apply yeah. basically to home office as a, as a normal, just low ranking uh, uh, officer, then you just literally that is even bigger vetting. But if you are like a yeah. leader or manager, <laughs> and it's just like, and he, and that was for years, his mom was already his PA. And she, she was stated on the official documentation. Yeah. She had access yeah. to the emails, she had access to the phone calls, she had access to everything. So oh, we I just worked like for the Home well. Office. I worked for the Home Office. I worked for the Ministry of Justice. Okay, I had to sign the Official Secrets Act when I worked to when I went mm. worked for Reliance Secure Task Management. I'm not ashamed. Mm. I, I ran a, mag mm. a magistrate's court and a Crown Court cell complex. I know how the system works. I was in the army, so I know what vetting you get from that. So I know how higher echelons vetting works. See, can I just oh. add as well, um, there's obviously rumours saying that with Dobbs Telgo's son where he works, it's also public information. Um, but the, it went public on my channel after they attacked Mandy's sister and doxed her children through Danny Roscoe. And uh, basically they're using that post we put of Roscoe and his public profile stating where he works at, we post it on the channel as it is public information already. So anyone that just goes around saying we docked Helgoa's son, just remember that it's already public information. And um, other thing is, um, in relation to Helgoa's son, um, the old, everyone's saying, oh, it depends what the basic secrecy act, oh, it depends, but he didn't agree with his mom's uh, views and this and that. Yeah, but they've still been meeting each other. They've been talking on the phone. They still have a contact with each other. Doesn't matter if he hates her or not. If he still have is in touch with her, he's not going to be vetted positively. He shouldn't be in this job position or oh, she shouldn't oh, on, be in oh, her oh, job oh, position. Oh, oh, on, if I can remember rightly, some of the questions on the... Uh on the actual official secret act form you've got to fill out was have you ever been or affiliated to like the likes of this was going back when like combat 18 and things like that you know this is you know these are this is the depths they go into on vetting people yeah and the higher you go up throughout the echelons the more vetting you have to you know but by then they've got all the vetting they want on you exactly they bet, but you, they to the, they bet you to the hill yeah, and a lot of people just claiming, yeah, but he didn't agree with his mom. Oh, yeah, but he didn't spoke uh, his mom. Uh, well, she's saying, oh, yeah, but they didn't spoke about anything. Yeah, but he didn't provide any information. Well, somehow they have uh, some information which they wasn't in the public domain. Somehow they, uh, Tommy, even Tommy was claiming that he have a people and he can get the information about everyone. Somehow they can get information from the HRMC uh, database. Yeah. Uh, somehow they can do lots of different things. And then... All of a sudden, Helgawa admitted by herself Then she actually was being told by her son about some investigations because we claims or we did say something online and uh, he's been flagged in because obviously he's related to her and he told her that he's been flagged in and uh, a lot of things. So that is actually a breaking secrecy act. He shouldn't be talking to her about anything, including mm -hmm. things like that. So, you know, it's the, the, the whole thing situation about Tommy now is just coming out. It's so strange because his links, the people which he's surrounded with, the people which he's using and even is now proven because Halgawa, she admitted that Tommy's using the XML5 agent. In Tommy own words, he, he even went to Peter Kelly actually wedding ah, in Ireland. So they know for, they know each other for far, far too long. And he was the ex mi 5 agent and he's still being used or, or he, he lives in the basic in the flat, which is being paid he's by HRMC. Control, I'm telling you, yeah. mi 5 Peter is keeping under control for the Home Office to be used as a weapon against political. There's a political battle going on and he's used, like Hope Not Hate. Without Tommy, there'd be no Hope Not Hate. With Tommy, you know... It's quite obvious what's going on. Everything we're seeing with Tommy and everything online is a big distraction from what they're doing in Parliament. Hmm. But 
but Tommy's making the most out of it by donations, donations, donations. You know, he don't give a damn about this country. That's why he's in Spain. He can put himself add, in the position. Can I just add as the Lodge? Lodge, um, to answer to your question why we are so obsessed with Tommy, because Tommy did lead, actually, a people into believing that um, he's going to help uh, survivors. They didn't help survivors. They did future groom and uh, exploit the survivors. They didn't help any survivors. They extort lots of money on vulnerable people. They did defraud lots of uh, vulnerable people. They did invent a lot of fraudulent campaigns, like for the bars, like for the studio. Um, we are just only citizens who actually seen the whole fraud. Partly we've been part of this fraud because we've been helping him with the research. That is one of the reasons why we're calling him out. That is one of the reasons why we're exposing this fraud. Because all of a sudden, maybe your mom, grandma, daughter, uh, anyone related to you might actually be defrauded by him and might be secretly paying him money in donations. Obviously, this is a day's choice, but they're doing it based on the false informations. Emotional blackmail with his poke. Exactly. That's why we're doing it. And if you don't like it, well, you don't need to listen to this. You don't need to be on the YouTube. You don't really need to pay any attention to what we're saying, isn't it? It's your own choice. But if you're paying attention to what we're saying and you don't like what we're saying, if you think we're telling the lies, prove us wrong. Because so Danny. far... Yeah. Thanks. Right. Go on. Danny, Danny, Danny. Why would we want to turn up to Telford? And mind you, the first Rape of Britain I went up and watched was a remake of some I've already seen. So that's why I didn't turn up for further further coverage of any of that at all. Well, Danny's so, wanting you to turn up because he, want, he wants to play the ego game because that's all it's about with Danny Roscoe. I don't think Danny will turn up anyway. No, of course not. He ain't turned up with Speaker's Corner every three weeks to do his live stream. Why is that? Is that well, another false promise just like Tommy? They don't know what, what people have been waiting for and they don't know really what is going to happen in Telford. So if Tommy really thinks then he will make a lot of new millions and hundred thousands of pounds, then he's foolish because the, the Rape of Britain number five and uh, streaming this in the Telford is already finished. But he's I'm in Catch gonna... 22, isn't he? He said he's going to put it out. He puts it out. It's already been exposed. He's going to mm. put himself... He's, he's in a situation. This is why the whole team and all those people around him, the cohorts, are all smearing us. You know, yeah, it's not they just me. Because yeah, yeah. They, they want to save this basically this uh, this Telford on the twenty seventh of uh, January, yeah. um, but, but they you know, they getting rid of all of us, including Wendy, Mandy, and everyone. It will actually solve the problem. It's not because people stop. People did stopped actually trusting Tommy. Well, look Robinson. what it's done. They they've opened their mouths and started talking about us again. It's been quiet through Christmas. Yeah, now look mm. at them today. If they had kept their mouth shut and not said nothing, we wouldn't have been here doing this live stream. Hmm. Explain why they're doing what they're doing, you know. And we, we're so, not the ones to jump on live streams. I mean, this is, this is how they're doing it. And I think it's disgraceful that Tyrant Finder had to go quiet to protect his family. I mean, yeah. who yep. are these people? Nobody's. They're just vicious animals online that have got a motive and we've destroyed their motive. And they're so angry that they're willing to slander us to the point of trying to get us killed. You know, well, calling me a baby basher and all that. Calling, they even made out clown assaulted his daughter, abused his daughter. Clown doesn't even have a daughter. I, I haven't got a daughter. <laughs> yep. First time I hear it, but if I have a daughter, I please know. come to me. Come to me if I have a daughter, yeah. my daughter. If you listen to me, the if is, you listen to this, contact me. I want to I wanna know you. <laughs> but every time they put up a slander, right, like, say for me, <laughs> over three and a half years of what they said about me being a child abuser. Go back every year on the channels and look how many times their story changes about me. They lie that many yes, times they can't I remember have, what um, they've said. I have a, yeah. It's mental because once you see it, can, you can't unsee it. Can I can I say something? You know when they, everyone's like they, they put out. I don't see. I don't see much real evidence put out on their part towards you. Yeah, there might be some. You might have a little bit of skeletons in your closet. I, but I've seen documentation a lot. This, um, is it an undertaking? Is it this APW, whatever? Well, I don't know, really. You know, I only pick up on little bits and pieces on it. They're supposed to be it. Clang. Do you know what I'm talking about? The Le um, leash years, yeah. Yeah. The, yeah. the, the paperwork that, that he's trying to make out is written by a six year old and there's no official document. <laughs> and the other. It's hundreds. Right. <laughs> 
as somebody that has worked in the system and seen lots of documentation like that, because, you know, being someone who has signed the Official Secrets Act, I'm not disclosing any names of any cases, but I can tell you the workings of these things. An undertaking is, is a document, it is in a, like a child case bundle. So it's lots of different things um, within that bundle. And if you enter an undertaking, and what it is, is it's written out by yourself, okay, as an undertaking that you won't do something for, you know, this, that, and the other. Yeah. It's an undertaking. It's not yeah. an admission of guilt, but you you write it yourself. It's not written by the court. The only thing it's the court does, stuff. the only thing, the only thing that the court does is make it legal by giving it that rubber stamp. Yep. Right? It's agreed in court that the undertaking so the undertaking is written out by the person making that undertaking it's a promising note to the court and he's not exactly. that promise exactly, yeah, exactly. I, I, you know i'm he's not on bail. involved in that argument what, what 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 he forgot it, yeah. is tyron is what is public information about family court is court dates nothing it, well the court trial dates no not the court date it's not the court itself but the um on the listings online I yeah, think but it's, it, it, myself. It, 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 and that is public never, information. Not the names, not the names. Not it's, the names of the child, no. It's, names it's, of the... it's like B versus Summer or other, or something versus mm. A. It's never like the names of, of the... But it's the fact is, they've, they've run that smear on me for over three and a half years, and we found that documentation dated from 2014. It's like, you know, they always, they say they accuse you of what they've done because it's stuck on their minds all the time with the guilt. If, like, they've got to they they've got to offload their guilt onto other people. It's, yeah, it's a well, Jupiter, it's a or what Wendy said, you know, with her son. Yeah. If someone can just explain what happened with the silly shares and all that stuff, because I think people in the chat maybe not or whoever listen may not actually understand this. Just quick wrap up. I let you do that, clown. <laughs> well, basically, Tommy Robinson is using a um, guy called Lee Sharis who runs the Antifa public, uh, public Watch. So he's supposed to be watching the Antifa, but what he does, he sits at home, he's watching different channels and just fought and just provide lots of different information against the Antifa on his own channel as his own work. Anyway, going uh, forward, um, they used to help hate each other. Now they love each other. And Tim Tommy, they're using him, them. Uh, to attack other people and dox other people. So uh, Lee shares he was uh, attacking Andy about alleged Andy abusing his own daughter. But what comes out is Lee shares was abusing his own wife. He did uh, put this undertaking uh, statement in the court. Then he will never ever do this or see her again. Go to the others, this and that. And he also did abuse his own daughter. Even when his own daughter was nineteen years old, he did admit that he restrained her, literally restrained her. Uh, in the uh, police, uh, uh, in the uh, cop car, because there was some domestic issues going on in there. Um, his own daughter and son don't want to see him anymore. They don't want to have anything to do uh, with him anymore. Even Lisha is, is not allowed to even know that she is pregnant, five months pregnant. Um, so the fact that he will actually be a granddad, um, which is obviously very telling. But they are the ones actually being used by Tim Tommy to attack other people and accuse other people of wrongdoings. So they're all hiding a lot of behind this. Yeah. Back. That's, what, that's so, why they're attacking others. I called them... Since I, hmm. since I posted that documentation, Chris, basically I had a uh, fake account called Clownwell post images of my own mum, my own dad, my family, who I haven't had contact with for 18 years posting to me in telegram saying we're sending them voice notes they're going to know who you are you're going to jail soon at that oh, yeah. through business. <laughs> and i sent the clown and just said look at them desperation they are trying to get into my head it's not going to happen they thought i wasn't going to be prepared although i will admit i didn't think it will get to the point as it is now but i knew what they're like with playing mental games because i was used by ginger tony to go and attack her enemies when I used to hang around with Team Tommy, she used to get me to attack the Patriot, James Goddard, Joe Drayson. Oh, by the way, Joe Drayson and the uh, police issue of them turning up at the camp. Everyone should be putting their eyes on Ginger Tony on that one. Oh. Yeah. 
Or is Ginger Tony? And Ginger Tony actually... wants to be careful because of what she said and done in the past to me that I have. What I want to say is they are the ones who are alleging against the police. They are the ones accusing everyone of being leftists, reporting everyone to police, uh, going to courts and just contacting people's employees. It's exactly the same thing what they've been doing to everyone who dare to yeah. speak against it's Tommy. It's like they're the organisers and what they organise, they use to distract with. They organise people to attack and do things for them, but accuse yeah. their enemy of what they've sent people to do. Yeah, but exactly they're doing this on the behalf of Tommy. And meantime, Tommy yeah. is just making the money, the, the throws and everything else. So if you are the one, if you are lefty and doing lots of different things, they will literally let off pedophiles, but they will go after you if you dare to speak against Tommy. Well, look at it. They're not calling out Lee Shears. They're not calling out Danny Roscoe. They're not calling out no. all the other EBL ex-members. Because they need them. Charlton. Because they need them. They need them. And they're Use not it. They need the black now, yeah. Yeah. They're not speaking up against Tommy, so they don't care. Now, if, if, for example, what was the name of this um, guy that who was actually put to jail for sharing the uh, 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 pornography with the animal? Yeah, Be Billy, yeah Billy Charlton. <laughs> Billy Charlton. He was fully defended by Tim Tommy and Tommy Robinson himself. And the guy literally admitted in the court that he did share in the WhatsApp group a child pornography involving child, child and the animal. He admitted in court, and they were still defending him after that. Oh, did they not set a donations but, for that as well? Yeah, I think that was. And and they going after us, accusing us of lots of different things. But they letting off the actual guy who did admit of sharing the thing. He obviously he got come out with explanation, then he didn't know what it is. Blah blah blah. He was as well with uh, Tommy Robinson in the in the WhatsApp group. So you know, it is they letting off the guy like that, but they actually will just trigger the whole planet against you if you dare to speak against the fraudster Tommy Robinson. Well, imagine if it was your mum that works for the Home Office, what they'll be doing right now with that information. Well, going to Home Office now. Imagine if it was me that got caught uh, private hiring an XMI5 agent to spy on one of them. Mm. Well, yeah, yeah, that's very you know? true. Yeah. They accuse us, like I said, they accuse us of what they are. They are informants. They're, they're, they're literally doing the work for the establishment. They've been used. Mm -hmm. Tommy has an XML5 agent around him. He's a spy. He does his information. Maybe he's the one that keeps Tommy in the right direction of where he needs to go with the agreement with the establishment. Did he do a deal with this Suella Braverman set up for this court case he's got against his silent stuff? I don't know. They're still contacting my um, ex employer and then it's basically trying to put the whole blame on me against my ex, actually my ex wife, because obviously they can't get into me. Um, so they try and go to after her. But like I said, it's just like, it's, it's a funny thing what they're doing because they forgetting the fact that first of all they can't do any research secondly they are not the ones who actually made tommy famous that was uh Kaylan, george and uh, lucy brown they are the free ones who actually made him a famous person without without them tommy will be never ever famous person he will never actually gain the oldest money and all this reputation well kind of reputation which he had now they all think because they are team tommy so they are above everyone else they know we learn in the whole this five years, we learn these tactics, we learn how they work. There's nothing, literally nothing what they can do to actually silence us. Now, apart of that, even if we will go on a long holiday, if we, even if we would disappear, everything is online. Everything what Tommy done in the last year, all these donations begging, all of that, there's like over 80 emails. People have enough. Because yeah. he, he, he's the man who actually claimed he has to run away from the country for the sake and safety of his children. He has to live in Spain. But from the sp he left them in here. From Spain, he was literally winding up everyone in the Britain. And because the people which he was winding up, they, they potentially they couldn't go to Spain to actually get hold of him. So the first thing they risk would be for his children because they will go after his children. So he didn't really done this move just to, for their safety. He done this move because that's exactly what he wants in the future. He just wants to move out from the country, just live peacefully somewhere else in the hot country, enjoy his life, and then just pop in from time to time in here, cause a mayhem and go back again. That's why he bought basically the flood and that's why he invested money in Spain. It's, it's fraud, absolute fraud.
Well, Nothing I'm just laughing it. at the comments. So I'm just looking through the comments and just looking at them. <laughs> you know, not one of them can question that anything about what we said with Helgoa, Ross Gower, Peter Keeley, Tommy Robinson, and the Rake right. of Britain. It's, just, it's, it's all just about you, about, me, about what you've done, Mandy. What you've done, yeah, what you've done. it's all about. It's like I'm not here to be famous. I, I'm not here to run a movement, nor am I even fucking thinking about doing anything of a kind. But it's like they're making it about us. Yeah. It's like I'm exactly, not interested about yeah. me. They're not clever, right. are they? They, they, don't, they're don't paying much more attention. Saying, <laughs> but look at us. They're, they're this, they're that. We can prove it, but we can't show no facts. So you have to believe in what we say. You know, it's the same shit you see on TR. Yeah. It's all talking. It? It's all talking. Yeah. But like I said, it's all done. It's all done. Even Tommy in the last 12 months, he done all the damage to himself. We didn't even if we didn't even stick the finger into anything what he's doing, and he done everything to himself. And people in the Britain, they decided they don't want to follow him anymore. They don't want to pay him money anymore. Mm -hmm. That's why he, exactly. majority of his money comes from the United States. And that's it. In Britain, he's finished. He's literally finished in Britain. They don't understand this. They can't get this to this head. They think when they will get rid of us, then Tommy will be famous again. Okay, we will step back for a month, for two months, for three months. He's still not going to get anywhere because people learn. People learn, people open their eyes, people seeing it, then they've been paying for over 10 years, 14 years now. And there's nothing literally changed from his side. He did not help any survivors. He did not done anything, literally anything for the survivors, for the for the grooming victims. There's no solution. All his channel is full of negative hate, hate, violence, hate. There's nothing positive. The only positive thing what you can see on Tommy Robinson's channel is him eating donuts. Yeah, or eating oh. something. Yeah, or <laughs> yeah. eating something. Yeah. yeah. Or enjoying his life. Not, that's his all. Is it, is it not him doing gymnastic stuff still? Oh, oh yeah. No, it's not. Not. <laughs> it, it wouldn't be so bad. I, I, I'm not saying, you know, you might you might disagree with me on this. As, a, as an outsider, you know, I, I was being drawn into the whole Tommy, you know, Tommy's like the saviour, you know, the whole movement that I actually started using my own critical thinking um then trying to be brainwashed by other people um maybe he's exposed stuff maybe he, he hasn't but since i followed and you know since i followed him i you know i've i haven't seen a studio you know no. haven't I haven't seen, seen a bus no Oh. I find the studio. I find the studio. I didn't see Shalom. No, oh, no, no. Um, and, and I'm, look, look, Wendy, you got to be. This is the first time I've ever spoke to you. I have the first time I've ever been on your show. But it, I am a complete somebody who sat on the fence completely. Sat yeah. on the middle of the fence. If you, you know, the whole immigration thing. Do we have a big immigration problem with people? We're allowing all these people into the country. Yes. We do. Huge one. You know, we, we need to con con control that. But if you want to come to this country legally, settle, work, uh, you know, but abide by, you know, my, my Christian and English British values, then exactly. come, come here, yeah. fine. But I haven't seen anything that from, from Tommy's side or anything like that or anything that he's promised so far. So... You know, I'm an actor. Tyrant, Tyrant, I, 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 I found the studio. I literally found the studio. <laughs> I found the full address of the studio. I found the studio and exactly what he done with the studio. <laughs> it was just marketing <laughs> campaign. Literally and, marketing and, campaign. And, and not to mention the the money that come from Ezra Levant. Yeah. Oh yeah. That, and all that. Sorry, I'm an outside. I've been watching it. I watched I watched hundreds and multiples of channels. You know, I had lockdown and shit like that to, you know, become educated on what's really going on in this world and who to trust and who not to trust. And I've been following <laughs> everybody. And it is now time for me to speak out that I, you know, I think I've got, I, I've, I've been trying to be slandered by a lot of people and I've kept a following. I still get quite a lot of views from lots of people. And even though I've had the left do hit pieces on me, like, hope, you know, hope not hate, you know, have got me on there. The uh, Antifa, Antifa, you know, 
fascist alliance. I'm more plastered over there as some far right fascist. But I'm oh, still right. doing all right. I'm for the people. I'm for everybody. Well, that's because you were seen. But you used to do no, live streams on seen. both sides. Yeah, no, it's because you I know was seen is. with the likes, you know, because I wanted to be accepted. I wanted to see the good mm. in everybody at the beginning. I was seen with the likes of Active Patriot. You know, you remember I, Black I, I, Van I Man? Seen... Sorry, he was oh, the yeah, same. Black Van Man. Man. Yeah. He was the same. He was the same as you. He was the same. He went on both sides of the protest, and one the left will start calling him far right because he went on the Tommy demo. Yeah, I was exactly. there that time. Yeah, exactly what happened um, to me because I've attended Tommy Robinson demos, and I wanted to see the good in everybody. I regardless, yeah, as soon as you start calling them out, look what they did to you. I mean, I remember yeah. that. I remember having a conversation with you at the time, and that, and I understood that you you had to go on the quiet. Hmm. And I, obviously, because I've I put I put everything public. I don't I don't care because I'm in a situation where I'm okay to do this. You know, I wouldn't no, recommend not, anyone. Who, who, whoever went to the state to me, they've got to remember. I haven't claimed benefits all my life. Sponge off of the like. No, I have really, worked all my life. I've served this country, but yeah, mm -hmm. I fell ill and got cancer and had to fall back and rely on the state. Yet somebody destroyed that's, that. That's why guys like us, working class citizens, pay taxes into the system exactly. to help people yeah. like you. You know, and then you've got these idiots, Danny Roscoe, Tommy Robinson, all these other fake plastic patriots. They don't even have a full-time job or pay taxes in the country. They're all just online begging for donations, jumping on anything they can to advertise, you know. You got Lee Garrett, he jumped on the anti u -less, claimed and bragged about making £500 selling number plates. Well, it's I like, don't care. Anybody... Uh, you, you know, um, oh, it's, it's, it's just, it's, oh, I, I, I just, I don't know. I've just, it's know, a mess, man. Because we've followed these people for years. It's just mm. depressing that, you know, you've wasted so many time, you know, thinking that they're going to come up with a solution. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's the most disappointing thing is that you get dragged in and you <laughs> think that you believe in it and you think that they're actually going to help this country. And then they, well, when nothing, they it, it was the lockdowns that woke me up with yeah, the Tommy yeah. Robinson. Yeah, because Tommy never came out through the lockdowns. He had a bus. I've got a bus license. I offered to do driving uh, for it with the video playing. Tony kept saying she'll ask Tommy. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I kept thinking he was Tommy in Spain. Robinson. Yeah, well, yeah. He, he I didn't know at the time. Well, we but, didn't know that. Yeah, that's right. But if you, if you know, Ginger. it's just how I met you, public. That's yeah, I well, that's, you, really, that's it. And that's where Ginger started ordering me to go and say stuff to certain people then i started thinking hold on a minute this isn't right you know i went with it for a little while to see what she was doing mm. and because i called it out after a situation i had with my ex and paul smith she uses that situation as the reason why i'm calling her out but she was causing shit for jack dawkins and using me to attack people that were friendly with jack dawkins joe drayson active patriot etc <laughs> And I didn't know there was a there was a war going on with the Danny Tomo stuff in with Ginger Tony and that until I come across Clown World, you know. And then things started adding up to it's me. It's all my phone on. now. <laughs> it's all my phone now. Yeah. See, I I learned yeah. what the team were like being around them. You know, Mark Benfield was begging for my loyalties, and I was like, I'm loyal to the truth and nothing but the truth. And if you're loyal to the truth, then we will we'll be loyal. Yeah. He yeah, didn't like me I saying that. Heard of Clown World, he was. What, what what I can, you know, fathom out that you were for Tommy. You were promoting yeah. Tommy. Yeah, yeah. And everything. Yeah. yeah. Why, you, you know, so, yeah, well, it's all weird to me that, you, you know, all of a sudden that you turn around, you somebody. Guilty, mate. We're guilty conscience. We, we supported someone and, and told people this man needs a chance, give him a chance, and then realised... That he's not a good man. He's actually corrupted. He's a fraud. He's a scumbag. He's an abuser. And I feel guilty to put him out as a good person. I brainwashed my bloody old landlord into thinking Tommy was a good person. And I feel bad for that. So I feel it's my duty to do what's right and be truthful and put out public. And I have. And their attacks has just made them look stupid and proven to the public that they are what they have accused us of. Antifa, lefties. Government shields, police informants, when they're the ones with the bloody connections. Yeah, but it's, 
with with our backing off from there was different stages. You did different stage. I did different stage because, I, like I said, my main well, I was. Well, they were attacking you. Yeah, growing. They were to that attacking point, you when I was it, coming out about Ginger Tony, and they was like, "Why are they attacking you for?" They thought you was telling me because what to do. I was questioning <laughs> the, the research which they asked me to do basically about this uh for the silence uh, video uh, so the they all case. i was already together. yeah i was already <laughs> questioning questioning basically the roscoe um and obviously i was already going through the six months battle with uh, some people uh, from my circle which they were saying now he's not he's he's not for the truth he's not for the truth now he's just literally taking mm. a piece now he's just letting letting this letting down now he's not telling the the, the truth that's the lie that's the well, lie you didn't so, force me you sent me you just said just watch you, you just get saying just watch him beg for donations yeah. and, you know what, yeah. what has he ever completed you know you've got me questioning tommy and that's when i you know as i was calling that team tommy oh, on that channel, you, know, you get me questioning fault. tommy and i i just came out with it all <laughs> and then then them lot were accusing me of being oh, part of clown world and I, was like, I don't even know who clown world is until you phoned me up <laughs> yeah <laughs> then i realized did, who uh, you really were. <laughs> we did spoken before we did spoken before when uh, in 2018 <laughs> right, but i didn't know who obviously. you were yeah, well, at that point, you know me. You did knew me from uh, the. I knew you were around Team Tommy yeah. and that, and you spoke to Ginger like, but I didn't knew it was you. You know, from the, the exposing TRR and APW about five years ago, it was like bloody hell. Hold on, <laughs> uh, Roscoe. Roscoe, can you just shut up? This the, the claims which you're putting in that the patriotic alternative is not far right. This is not. This is that. You know, you just the stated then basically uh, there's no big deal if people sniffing a coke on the demonstration uh, supporting the grooming victims. You are just cretin. Just just shut up, please. Seriously, everything what you say is just like. You're embarrassing yourself, literally embarrassing yourself. Oh, I mean, if you yeah. can't, it's, oh, no, it's all know. comments. I can read the comments, and it's just like he's just like going off his head, isn't it? Yeah. Well, he, he was the one who originally uh, called Mandy Mosley money bags. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe she have a money bags of full of money. It's her thing, isn't it? Well, it's it was like... his jealousy, wasn't it? Because Tyrant finally got a donation, and he didn't. Yeah. <laughs> it's like that's, how that's old are you, true. Roscoe? That's You're forty. You're acting yeah, like that's a. True. Yeah. If that's it true. wasn't for Mandy, I was going to give it all up because there was no way I could continue without a, com without a computer. Oh, bless her. Good on her, and yeah. good that you yeah. kept going. And what I, I wasn't was going to... What I wasn't Tyrant, going to was that your crime, love? Was, was that your crime? <laughs> no. <laughs> he accepted donations. donations. <laughs> you accept <laughs> donations. You, you should send yeah. them donations to Danny Roscoe. <laughs> you, uh, donations. It's selfish. Selfish. Oh selfish. They've created a conspiracy theory amongst themselves about us, and they're so <laughs> completed, inundated of all the lies they put out about us. They just, they, they just can't prove anything they say. Anything they put out, like like Ginger Tony in the last two days, and Dave Smith of all people, who I don't even speak to or get, you know, a right no. to reply. You know, no. they post voice notes of mine with no context. Now, if people knew what Helgo and Ginger Tony were doing, as in talking to alleged victims, like calling them whores and sluts, and wait till I smash your back doors in, then you'll understand why I leave certain voice notes to those two women. That I I just said Helgo and Ginger Tony. You know, they, they're supposed to be with Tommy Robinson, who's supposed to be for survivors and victims. But you hear the two front runners, a team Tommy, talking and calling someone a whore and slag. Mm. You know, that gets me. I, I yeah. can't hold myself but they, back. But they accuse you of actually attacking the survivors in the, the Rape of Britain uh, documentary yeah. exposure one, two, and three. They accuse, accu literally accuse you of attacking Tony Robinson on the on the actually Telford scene when he was on the that. He literally yeah, but, said that me and you, we are attacking the survivors. How dare we are. And now they are the same people. But do you know what they the say? Thing. She's not a real survivor. That, that's their response to it. She, I mean, whether she's a survivor yeah. or not, if you should not be calling people that at your age as a parent. Exactly, but they accuse you of doing it. They accuse me of doing it, it with the rape of Britain one and two when I had nothing to do with the rape of Britain one and two and three exposure. But they did accuse us of it and they're doing this mm -hmm. this exactly same thing. So what I'm saying is whatever they accuse people of is exactly what they're doing to other people. 
They are just banjo yeah, scumbags. They, they, now, they just they, expose themselves every time. Uh, they expose themselves. Like I said, even if we disappear, when they disappear, man, they disappear, I, Athena, everyone else will disappear. Tommy Robinson is still not getting anywhere. Danny Roscoe is still no, not getting anywhere no. because they are already exposed themselves. It's already done, dusted, finished. It's, we can literally just sit back, get a popcorn, glass of wine, whatever, uh, whatever anyone likes to drink, and we can just watch the show because he's not getting anywhere. He it's finished now if they will keep attacking us if they will keep going after uh, after us this way which they done today then i might actually uh show them my different side of me from 2024 not through 2023 because 2023 i was actually going on them very lightly if they wanted me basically to go different way and if they want to really <laughs> see the whole the power of the, the whole the crown world then i'm happy to show them all of that but obviously they are mouthy nobody's they only basically mouthing all online but we danny roscoe did prove exactly what it's what he's capable of when he actually is um well, being, we being had him in a chat invited, in, invited for a drink <laughs> i would say yeah we, we had him in a chat and he was crying about us stopping him from posting media because he pawn bombed the chat like he did on yeah. youtube that time right exactly. so he kept saying I, I want post media unlock media unlock media this is on the telegram chat and i said if you want to post media post it on your own channel do you know what he posted on his own channel a picture of a lorry of a company i used to work for that he doxed um, i got yeah. him to post that on his own channel i made him do that without telling him basically to post because he's a nice because he's he a, supposed to no, say very very That's good so laptop, isn't it? because he's so like dog. why are you posting a picture of a lorry of a company that i used to work for so what, <laughs> what? you just cutting. exposed yourself on your own channel people have been is wondering why you're posting a picture of a lorry for and also this is the man danny roscoe's the man who thought world war ii started in 1980s <laughs> world, world war one in 1930s <laughs> that's, that's what right. it did. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah. <laughs> and yeah. he done this this video exactly in the back with the background of the the um isle of shippel isn't it shippel shippel yeah, the isle yeah. of shippel based on that <laughs> when i when i went in actually there and i said god that's exactly the background because i was driving past that and i said that's exactly background which he actually done this video the famous video about the world war one and i say i got you rosco i know exactly where you live and then i trigger all my skin my little troll spies you know uh, you told him to I, name I, a local pub yeah. and, <laughs> you, and he named the local pub and you was 12 minutes away <laughs> yeah, exactly and then i say rosco how about we sit down we'll, we'll basically see each other for a pin and he said come on come on i'm waiting for you come to this pub so i went in there i recorded everything walking to the pub going outside this and that and he wasn't Sorry. there so i say and then he said oh just wait for me i said listen roscoe i'm already away anyway but if you want i can go back anyway he just went in there like 90 minutes later recording everything pack up his car on the basically like all the side of the big massive car park walking through the whole the car park chatting to his camera and say yeah i come in he walked, walked he, into the car. He, did, he didn't even try the door and he said oh it's closed and then he just ran away that's the big, a bright big orange clothing as well He's yeah in bright like a orange clown clothing. like a clown comical show you know it's like how easy are these people just to you know motivate to do this on their own channels it's yeah, like trolls, keyboard uh, warriors they, they give mean, us a spotlight you know, just... would think that world war two start no that world war one started in the 1930s i mean someone oh, who's not someone educated. who don't know his history yeah <laughs> but where did he come from revolution. Where's, where's his business? Where did he come from? Because we've got a lot of his history now. And he seems well, to be the sort of person that's always wanted following. I don't want to say he's, much. He's but celebrating was getting a... a follow on Twitter. He, he, remember the posts on his Twitter, his old Twitter account we found when he supported yeah. the uh, Lawrence stuff. The oh, no, London. only that. Lerner, I will tell mm -hmm. you now, everyone, I will tell all of you now. I can't just wait and keep it. I see mm -hmm. on it. So, Danny Roscoe, he's very against the LGBT, <laughs> right? He's very against the LGBT, but would you believe that he was actually supporting the black LGBT movement? He was literally supporting a black <laughs> LGBT movement. <laughs> oh, that's interesting, isn't it? Yeah, and it's on public. You can search it yourself. Just search his uh, like, name, Danny Scott Coleman. How, Just search yeah. his name, you'll find it. How he was so, <laughs> so, so far left. Yeah. Yeah. Is Danny going to answer any question or is he going to spout off? You know, he's going to mouth. He'll spin. Please, please, please answer, answer this question, right? 
the, the day you were up in London at the Palestinian protest, the day that you were verbally abusing that police constable sat on his uh, motorcycle <laughs> and having your camera, right, bobbing <laughs> off, I 100% guarantee you, you were doing that for clout, mate. Doing it solely for clout. And you know what I mean? And you must have known, you must have known that, you, you know, within, within 20 minutes of that, you actually doing that, somebody's posted it, you're wanted by the Met Police, and then you get picked up for whatever you did to it. <laughs> Why did you do that, Daddy? He made that it was clown as well. You know what? He, he wanted you know what? he wanted a motorbike. You know what? Do you know why I very seldom get arrested? And because I know how to speak to people with respect on both yeah. sides of the law. Yeah. And what's more importantly, I know the law. Okay. I just don't watch a few YouTube videos and think, you know what? I'm going to try a little bit of this because I've seen other people get away with it. And I'm going to try it myself. But what I would really, really do, Daddy, right, is leave it to the professionals, right, who really do care for the people, who really do want to make a change for this world, and who really wants to rid the planet of people like you that just wants to leech out of people. I might claim everything I've got off of the state. That I I'm I've got very little now because people have made that their life goal to destroy me, and they they they're, they're close to it, but they've not only destroying me, they're destroying my family. That's what the saddest part about it, right? And yeah. what I try and do is is try to bring a little bit of truth out there, what's really going on. But all you're trying to do is spout hate amongst everybody. And what I read in your in the comment tonight, it, you you said nothing. You commented on nothing. You, you just spread the, the same and same and same. So when I actually see you do something that's worth watching, you know what I mean. What do you do? Well, what do you do? At least the videos that I put out, however little professional they are, is trying to educate people. Yeah. But I'm, the one thing I don't do, I don't deliberately go out there to be nasty to somebody just for a little bit of clout and that's all you did that and it backfired on you didn't it i, I think he wanted to just free ride on the police motorcycle isn't it that's it <laughs> i thought it i thought it was pretty disgusting because oh yeah he was what what, what reason what what reason behind that what, what was the reason behind that there was no Even, reason I, was, i've got i've got a coke, coke on coke, isn't it? yeah i've got a dislike into the police on some of that well let's let's get that wrong so not all cops are bad cops it's just some cops that give a bad you know what i mean there mm -hmm. are a lot of good cops out there right but yeah you what you did to him on that bike i wouldn't even do as a as a youtuber and and there's a lot of youtubers out there that wouldn't do that either for clout well you Black give the respect rest. you want to receive don't you and that's how you yeah, treat yeah, people yeah. Rusko didn't he instantly went and attacked that cop Mm. But because you they're know, trying to copy Tommy, isn't it? They're trying to that, get arrested. It? Yeah, but they're trying to get arrested. They're trying to basically, you know, just trigger some big, massive thing and then just ask them, hey, campaign, so, yeah. I want to help, I want to this, I want to that. You know what I mean? It's just like, what this cop even was guilty of? Of what? Because he was well, being there on the, his because motorcycle. He was, no, because he was there. Is that, yeah, because, because he, was, he there. was there. And because Roscoe was cooked on, on coke and obviously he couldn't find any drama. That's he like where he excited, has to cause any drama, yeah. He got too excited, you know, he just shit his nappies and, uh, mm. you know, it's just like, it's, it's weird, but this, this guy is just like, he's so well, in, uh, low that's intelligent. I put just... his comment up, clown, because he's saying, clown, you're weird. So, I, mean, I think he means, so what if I supported LGBT black movement? Well, well now you're against it. That's yeah, what. yeah, exactly. Clown's point is that you're always moaning about LGBT, whatever. What you go woke? What you go woke and report you now? But, yeah. but not when it comes to the LGBT black movement. What is the difference? Skin color. He's racist. He depicts yeah, people by the skin color. Yeah. yeah. Hmm.
is Brusco, his we'll radar. Be the same, but some of us have got a bit of a mental problem, mate. You know, and I think you need to go and get some help. He's low intelligent. He always was basically asking for fame. Obviously, his life was completely, absolutely, you know, embarrassment. This is what he's done to his ex, to basically kid and all that stuff. They don't mm. want to know even him. Now, he's hiding the fact. That's why he changed basically his name. But do you all remember when he was claiming that he's not Scott Tomlin? How many times yep. do we have to prove that he was known as Scott Tomlin? Because that was his name. And then he was all denying, saying, we are liars, we're saying bullshit, we, we are this, we are liars, blah, blah, blah. And all of a sudden, you know, we proved he's literally a Scott Tomlin. And then, you know, it's just like every time we just catch, catching him on all these lies and he just keep carrying on, we are liars. Well, well just, he admitted, proved. Uh, <laughs> just proved. He admitted it and then denied it, then admitted it, then yeah. he denied it. It's like he was avoiding. Because he's confused. <laughs> he's confused. Everybody like, knows who I, I am. Choose, Everyone knows it? my <laughs> real name. Everyone knows who I am. I've got nothing to hide. If you've got nothing to fear, so? nothing, nothing to hide, nothing to fear. Put your name out there. It's not all that. Your name's your name. If you're going to go on to the likes of YouTube and shit like that, people are going to People are going to want to know you. People are going to want to know you. Gonna and you're going to make enemies, and you're going to make critics, and these people well, can't stand criticism. With me, was different. And now they become our critics. Different. I knew what they will do, and that's with me was different. You know what I mean? It's just like when you when you are around them, when you're basically doing the research and all that stuff, you know you're going to get uh, you know attacked. Yeah. The second thing is we we also working with the survivors. We also working with the charities. You can't just keep putting your name out in there because obviously, automatically, your the whole the voluntary work which you do, it's just like you know but, you're gonna get attacked, you're gonna get slandered. You, you, this is what the claims they put in. They or literally they was putting the claims recently after the first stream with Wendy. Then I was like, they have pictures, so I posted my own pictures of me in Braful with some guy basically doing something on me and all that stuff. And it's just like it, it, the, the claims which they're coming out with. It's just the whole thing is like I'm just looking at it. It's just a wall. Yeah, when you came on my stream a few times in the last few weeks. To me, it was just a chit chat. It wasn't yeah, anything. Yeah, for me too. <laughs> for me too. It's just like you know? catch up, isn't it? Yeah. But it was for them, <laughs> ego. For them, it was really ego because, oh, Clown is speaking out. We have to silence him now. Call for the army. It's just like a dickhead, isn't it? <laughs> but what I want to say is just like they, they are so un low intelligent. They don't understand. Wherever the whole damage is done, it's just now. Every single day, every single week, every single month, there will be more uh, fruits. Basically, people will be picking up from this whole damage, from the whole work. It, 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 even if we disappear, if we will be basically hang on the basically all from I the know, power, uh, yeah. it's yeah. still gonna stay in there. It's still they're not gonna get anywhere. They still should really reconsider these futures because they are finished. That's they literally throwing their trees out the pram, mate. That's what they've done. They, they've got oh, nowhere yeah, to no go, big, and they big. want the same. Sorry. No. Danny, you know, I say you can't spell victim, right? But you know, but I, I, I shouldn't become a, I shouldn't victim. become a grammar police because they're the jet accused me. That's my only argument I got is correcting, correcting the the grammar of Danny. Danny, mm. I, I, I put myself into situations for the good. Yeah, I've done everything I, I've done. But yeah, I probably brought on myself. But you know, that's what you you do when you're over the target. And it was ever it's since worth it to day, expose them, though, isn't it? It's yeah, worth, worth it to put it. yourself on the target. But ever since I, um, you know what I mean? Because like, you all fooled me once because I was Mr. Popular. I more, you know, I could probably elevate your success. Uh, that I elevated a lot of other YouTubers' success, and they've all fell by the wayside now. And nobody's there, but who's still going? A little old me. It, yeah, well, yeah, yeah, he still can understand. He's still putting basically comments. Then it was so if he was supporting the LGBT black movement, yeah. where is the proof? The proof is Daniel Roscoe. The proof is on your old Twitter uh, channel on the <laughs> Scotty Tomlin channel, right? You There's a proof the in there. You you have you lost the password. You can delete it. We did. Everyone can see it. He made a Daniel post Roscoe. saying that he lost the password for it as well. Yeah. <laughs> and the, the, the whole point why we bring this up because you claim you claim you literally attacking the all the LGBT movement, you're literally calling everyone basically like be, be, be males, better males, whatever, whatever, transgenders, all that stuff. But you was the one supporting them. You was the one actually taking the, uh, you know, the, the full full force and helping them actually grow. And all of a sudden now you are all against them. That is only showing your hypocrisy. The same thing is with your 
claiming to be alpha male. You're claiming to be alpha male, but not far long ago, you've been actually painting the high heels into pink Barbie style ah, high yes. heels and you've been selling them. <laughs> That is only showing your hypocrisy because you're not alpha male. You are just mouthy beta male. That's who you are. You are attacking women. You just you are so afraid to face me or public annoyance. Then you have to hide. Well, I often I often in the kettle. Yeah, he sent Ginger Tony <laughs> to my address. Well, to my oh, yeah. workplace. Obviously. Ginger Tony made out. She turned up because I was wanting her mum's address or something. I was like, well, where's this come from? I don't even yeah, know but, your mum. I've never heard of your mum. That was her reason for turning up at my work. Yeah, but at the it end was of the just day, kind of but at the end of the day, and me, you know, I I come from a whole different world to that. You, yep. you, you know, it's the insinuation that I could come for a cup of coffee. We all knew what she was there, there for. To me, that's an idle threat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Why well, it should never be? You, you know what I mean? That uh, that to mm. me is disgusting behaviour. I come yeah, from but, a whole different world. I, you know, how were these people brought up? I don't know, but to me, that's a that's a reason. To, like, if someone did that to me, that would be a, and belong to the group she belongs to. That's a reason to call the police. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It, well, I did. Away. I did yeah. find the police, and yeah. the Suffolk police get past me to Met Police. Met Police get past me back to Suffolk Police. But either way, I had to send all the screenshots of all the arguments and what caused it and what where it's led to. Wow. I had to put it all to the police. But Good. right yeah. now, I, I don't bother. This. I'm not calling police. What I did actually, I went to Tesco and I bought myself a, a big black uh, bean bag. <laughs> I did say to Tommy, then I will send all of his basic mates back to him in the bean bags. Back to him in the bean bags. So if they want to turn up, uh, they are more than happy to turn up. That's it. What will happen later, I can't mm -hmm. say it, but you know, I mean, I know the self defense rules. Now, um, Duchess, you're just claiming in the chat that Danny Roscoe is going on the street and do his bit. So can you just. Just bring some examples because he's on the scene in like four years now. How many times actually he went on the street? Because as far as I'm concerned, he well, still promised uh, to be uh, every three uh, weeks. Uh, yeah. I can tell you that he goes on the street every 5th of November. That's a lot. That's a lot. I remember yeah. the 5th of November. I got a good I, video of him. I he remember, the remember the 5th of November. Yeah, he missed the last one. He never went in there. Uh, he said this year was going to be, or well, last year was going to be bigger than last year. That's right, it? yeah. But he didn't went in this year. It's like Tommy, full of talk and no go. Yeah. Well, if, if this so year is going to be bigger than last year, so what's that? He's only got a stream. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. He didn't go out now. because his name's gone out. You know, yeah, since but... we put Scott Tom and Matt, he's not gone out and done live streams. Yeah, and again, he promised to be in uh, Speaker's Corners every few weeks, and he's literally not. He's not well, since his name got Tom I've, been, went out. I've, I've, I've been so many times in there trying to catch up with him, you know, for a pin or whatever coffee, you know, they, they have a really nice cafe in there, but he's not actually coming there. He, he's just, for me, going there, you know, I have to pay congestion charge, I have to pay basically Euler's charge, I have to pay a car pack, that's like 80 quid altogether. You know, it's just like, come on, man. At least yeah, when you're something, you something, guys. Can we, can we talk let me about all something really old? I don't know if it's relevant if we want to talk about it or not, but mm -hmm. you know, going back, um, Daddy Dragon and people like that, and oh yeah, yeah, I remember them, yeah. The Workers of England Union, mm. and they put out this press mm -hmm. association card, mm. yeah, and we all joined yeah. it because it was going to protect us, this, that, and the other. Then yeah, they got, yeah, yeah. then they got taken to the High Court, and I was used as their. Um, the prosecutions, you, you, you know, they were using me and they were doxing my address out, Daddy Dragon and all that. They were all part of it. That's when I started to realise then everybody knows each other. Mm, that's and it. it, it is, and it's all all the people, they, they, they make out they don't like each other or they don't speak to each other. But when you start getting in there... Mm. Um, they all know each other. Yeah, they all know each other. They know each other and... I remember weird. the first time you came to me, Tyron, and I was like, well, you know, someone with views that you get is actually watching and seeing it for yourself, and you give me your own verdict of what you've seen. Mm. And then you said, you've got some things you like to say. I was like, fucking hell, but you're, you're one of quite a few that's come to us. You know, and there's a few that we can't even mention about, which is really like hard. Mm. 
just because of the attacks these people have done. I mean, you say about them contacting family members. They've actually have contacted family members I haven't spoken to, like I said, in 18 years. Thankfully, I'm now in contact with three because of what they've done, sending messages to my family members. You know, all the things that they're trying to do, has, there's been some good come from it. Can, can I just ask you guys, do any of you know if Tommy Robinson's got a proper press pass then? Uh, no. <laughs> no. 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 Because you I tried have... to... No, but no, he, right, it's, it's, it's a, I, I tried to apply for one, an actual NUJ card, because I thought, you know, I was going so I might as well. Mm. You know, take up a new profession. I'm going to need to be good at it. People are yeah, mm. but... Yeah, okay. there's a lot of different press it. passes. Um, yeah, you, the NUJ card you have to actually get um, published work. Well, That's Tommy right. Came to have published work, but really we know it's really woke, really leftist um, ideology within the NUJ. Anyway, um, you wouldn't get one because they see the type of work that Tommy publishes. He wouldn't get an NUJ card. Yeah, they have different mm. type of uh, basically press passes, associations, private, for example, yeah. like, you know, yeah. the Daddy Dragon, he set this set up. So Tommy, he had some kind of press pass, but it's not like the proper one, which obviously is respected everywhere. They, he can go to number 10 and all that stuff. It's a kind of like low ranking and other organization, which is just support, um, you know, just kind of street activists and all that stuff. Um, Hang on a minute, because like... Yeah. Ross and the workers of England press pass, which they had mm. to change their name on because of the PA, um, because the workers of England called it the summer or oven, and P Pre the Press Association took them to court. That's worth nothing because that's not a recognised card. No, yeah. I, I, exactly. That's why he wouldn't show his press card to the police that day when they exactly. asked him. Yeah, because and the fact that he. The fact that he works for Urban Scope, obviously, he, what he did in this video, he, he admitted that he actually works for Urban Scope and he's being paid by the Urban Scope. So Urban Scope is owned by his wife. In theory, the director is uh, Adam Gary, so the number two in Tommy movement. Um, so he did admit that he actually works and he's getting paid. So why he's asking for donations when he actually works and getting paid? That's another question, you know what I mean? Then you got this all these hidden businesses which he set up and he admitted in his own voice messages, like the um, design uh, uh, clothing um, yeah, uh, yeah. thing, warehouse. Um, you know, he, he is getting money. He just like he just doesn't like to share the money with Daniel, type of Daniel Roscoe, Ginger Tony, and all the people, right? You know, they're being oh, paid just on these um, stewarding, isn't it? So when um, someone wants why did Tom Zero leave uh, the Tommy camp? Because Tom Zero that one. did said, yeah, Tom Zero did said too much, and he did ask for too much. Tom Zero has been been used for the the Rape of Britain number one, two, three, four for the yeah. editing and camera work. However, Tom wasn't paid. Tom, he was doing this as a voluntary work, and he was using all his benefits and all the money he which he actually had. So it no. almost broke, broke. Yes, it almost broke him completely. So the latest one before actually he left or he's been pushed away, I would say he mm. did make a stream. And on the stream, he said to people, if you want, again, Tom Zero News, you have to do what you used to do and just basically pay um, because he was so, so broke. Now, Tom Zero News make a big, massive mistake because he was start asking for money for at least uh, covering the costs, his own costs. Uh, which obviously wasn't in wasn't taken lightly by Tommy, but because Tommy doesn't like to pay people, he wants people to work for him for, him for free, uh, just as an appreciation. Um, and Tom Zero News as well, he made a stream on the stream accidentally. He did said he did state then when they um, when they record the rape of Britain, I think that number three was where this Irish pub owner, he was accused of being part of this grooming gang or knowing about the rapes and all that stuff. So they almost destroyed his business. But Tom Zero News, he said, they never had any actual evidences against that guy. And he done this on the on the live stream, literally on the live stream. Oh, wow. Which I recorded. So I have this, this one and I'm going to publish this tonight or tomorrow. Um, he literally said, they never had any evidences against that guy. They followed the feeling. <laughs> At the end of the day, but, they literally destroyed the guy business because they was following the feeling. Asking to come on. 
<laughs> yeah, and the fact is, uh, then Tommy, when Tommy actually uh, uh, confronted this uh, Irish pub owner, he did <laughs> state into this guy that he had evidences against him. But then again, from Tom Zero News' mouth, comes out that they never had any evidences. So, what documentaries are we talking about? What the truth is in these documentaries? It's so many things, basically. But like yeah. I said, I wasn't part of the of the exposing <clears throat> this first one, two, and three. But that was Andy, Athena, and Mandy. But um, I've got a yeah. question for Ginger Tony. Um, I made a video ten minutes long on my channel, and the question is the blackmail that she's covering for for Tommy Robinson and Danny Tomo. She's asking mm -hmm. to come on live stream. I don't know if she wants to answer that question. To what? To mouth, Would you want me to let her on? Do you want me? To you guys it's entirely up to you wendy but just be prepared prepare be prepared because for... <laughs> <laughs> she would go out and off her head yeah, she, you don't know how much amphetamines someone's had that's all i'm gonna say well she was with her mom so i assume they didn't sniff the oh, right, okay. she'll, be, she'll be nice and calm then i'll give her <laughs> hopefully Already, there's because... comments I don't like. Don't talk to baby. Be uh, yeah. Oh. Well, we'll just see. But um, yeah. But I, I, Tom Zero News. Um, he's got a lot of problems, hasn't he? So he's not. Well. Yeah. And have you have you realised then? Then um, Tommy Robinson is actually using a lot of people which they are vulnerable. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. There's I mean, something not right in there, is it? Close to tears sometimes when he does stream. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and he once posted a very strange stream um, of Tommy talking, but it was um, dubbed into Russian. <laughs> mm. a, a very strange video it was. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> he made a mistake. I did have, I had a chat with uh, Tom Zero News after he left, and uh, he wasn't happy with what he's he seen. So um, he doesn't want to really go into the details because obviously he wants peace with uh, Tim Tommy and he knows exactly what will happen if he will just open up about what he's seen and experienced. But in his voice message, basically, he did claim to me that he wasn't happy what he's seen while being around Tommy. He wants to open up, but he, he's too scared to because he um, knows what they'll do well, to him. Look, that's look, exactly yeah, what he's saying. You can hear it in his voice. He's, he, look, yeah. he's vulnerable. He's literally vulnerable. He, yeah, so I'm, I'm not. That's why I say I see him as hear, a vulnerable person. Yeah, he's like, he heart voice. and passion, but yep. he's been. He knows. He knows. He's, he, he's done wrong by staying silent about it, and he feels mm. guilty, and he takes that anger out and clamored yeah. quite a bit. He do. He do, and that's why I didn't. Um, um, that's why I didn't right. want to basically just spread press anything and just basically i left it where in there isn't it because yeah. it's just like if let him say what he wants you, let him, then and just you have to balance cool. yeah yeah you have to uh, balance he's not the one that we're because... exposing you know he's not the one who we're taking mm. down he's just someone who happened to be involved like we was yeah he's so, blaming so... us <laughs> he's blaming <laughs> us for many things like him not getting money <laughs> and like that. tony wants to know what she's been accused of guys oh um, i thought she's jumping on she wants the ever to get the evidence before she jumps on. And how is she going to present this evidence? <laughs> <laughs> and what will really she be in a Come on, Ginger. Of? Come on, Ginger. Jump on. Come on. Well, Let's I asked the question. Let's have Why it. did on. she turn up at my work saying that I wanted her mum's details? I mean, where where did I say that I wanted well, your mum's details? I want to ask the question why they contacted my employer. I want to ask yeah. the question. Why, why did you email my the, the boss death, telling that I'm death. still taking drugs and attacking survivors? Right. Why they put the, why they put the de de detectives after say my house? No, no, no Tony. Um, Tony, no, no, no one's worried on here. We want you in here. Come on, come this on, guys. Happened because you, Tony, um, got Jupiter to do a stream today. Um, Keep doxing left and right, on. And because Jupiter's, Jupiter uh, likes to involve everybody, I've got a video which I'll play tomorrow now because um, it's personally about myself I, and these guys, uh, but I'll play it tomorrow now where I can more or less say, you know, that I don't <laughs> like what you're doing because you're trying to involve people who are not involved in anything. You're trying to get at people and it's come from nowhere, Tony. So that's why this is happening if i want to have a chit chat with cut with clown world in the middle of the week or on a stream that's up to me come on ginger 
Come on, come on, doctor, lefty doctor, jump on. Don't be worried. Don't be afraid. No one's gonna say anything bad to you. She needs a, she needs a bitch before coming on, mate. Oh, yeah, I've hold on. Put the link in there twice. Give, give her five sec. Give her five seconds for a sniff. Yeah. I'll put it in again in case you missed it. Probably she missed it. <laughs> well, she won't answer the question. She'll just shout and scream. Well, then I'll remove her because I don't put up with the world. <laughs> I, well, I don't. No, but this, like, you don't get. You don't get anywhere. This already really started for us asking questions, putting it out there. You know, this is how it all started. Yeah. Okay. She's going on the Jupiter as it directly. <laughs> she's not coming. <laughs> I want to say pussy. So what is their problem? Why can't they speak with us? Why can't they <laughs> speak with us? They know we will prove questions? it. Why they, they, they know we, we will prove it. They know we will exactly. But they're Tommy it posted down. on their channel. If you have questions about anything, including what he posted, just to ask. She and look what they're doing. She arrived in the in the. Hang on, we we were talking. She arrived in the chat. Asked what I I had seen her asked to come on. I ignored it. Then you guys mentioned it, so I thought, oh, maybe she wants to come on. And so I've I've let I've said she could come on. Now when I've explained why she has to come, why you guys are here and we do <laughs> she don't want she's to come to on. The part. because look. <laughs> Wendy, don't take me wrong, none of them can debate either me or Andy because we have so much fact in our hands, they can't really answer any question. Um, they, we will stick to the bullet points, they will do not talk over us, and that same happened today on the Ghost basically uh, stream. On the Ghost stream, they everyone tried to link me with Danny Jones, with Simon Law, with Wendy. I said, I don't give a care about them, you're putting accusations against me, put them against me. I don't care what they said. They can say whatever they want to say. It's nothing to do with me. So if you have an accusation, put it put towards put towards me. Oh, because Mandy done this. Yeah, ask Mandy about it. So what is about you know what is the whole accusation to me? That's what we always sticking in to the bullet point short word accusation to me. Not about someone else. Just if you have accusation towards me, put it towards me. They can't answer. They can't talk. They can't debate us. They literally can't because they're losing every single debate. Well, um, clown. Apparently, you've been saying things about me, and I gotta wait till I hear it. Well, it's not. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm happy for you to hear it. I just said I don't care what you said, and I don't care give a shit about anyone else. Yeah, because but, they, the, um, the guy was putting told the accusation that I'm a bullshit, uh, I'm professional bullshit, and all that stuff. So I did ask him put me anything. But, what I actually uh, said was clown, true. Clown, hang on. I'm not the sort to care. I don't oh, no. <laughs> I, I, I just, no, I would advise everyone to actually watch this stream, the ghost uh, ghost uh, stream. <laughs> I think that the title is uh, the question and answer is blah blah blah. So I would it's literally funny. advise everyone to watch it because at least she destroyed all funny. three of them, three of them, even Jupiter jump on, <laughs> and then she ran away as once I start asking the questions, and she just literally ran away. Everyone was put uh, into basically these places. She wants to know if she'd be allowed to play your voice notes of course voice note pardon whose voice notes yours mine yeah they can play whatever she wants she already played so many times everywhere there you go tony <laughs> you think <laughs> she would just like spread me or something i don't know she already playing it a million times but what that got to do with anything that the fact that she tried to dox me and you know she got jupiter It'd be interesting yeah. to see what she's going to smear you with next. Well, it'll probably be something no annoying to the topic. Is yeah. it going to be an original voice note or cut, edited, snap up version like they do and post on their channel with a narrative over it? it really I would it. like her to jump on, not just being I think a when co co I, know, I do think when you go, uh, when you get to know the tricks of what people do, where they cut it and slice it and do everything with these voice notes, it doesn't really worry me. Um, yeah. All no, right. Ginger, Ginger, Tony, you yeah, you Ginger Tony, stop know. typing. Just come on. Ginger Tony, seriously, stop don't typing. Just come on. Come on. Yeah. We're waiting for you. Don't let us wait for like. See, again, it's yes. all about making it about us. It's like stay off the narrative of what we originally did for them to attack us on. And, hmm. you know, don't let the public know why we're attacking them. Just keep smearing them. Hmm. Well, Who well are this we? is why we're doing the stream because of what they've done today, which was obviously. You what, love? I appreciate it, Wendy. I really do. You know, I didn't know none of this. I didn't even know even Jupiter was talking about my personal stuff until you yes, mentioned it. Was, yeah, right. and good to hear actually, Tyrant. I didn't spoke with him for quite and, a while. And I now. found it yeah. absolutely disgusting, Tony. So 
Ginger Tony, um, you need to ask Jupiter about her own um, experiences with people beating up children because one of her own family members did exactly that. So when you're running around calling Andy this, that and the other, when it's all been through social services or whatever, you need to look at who you who you um, think is great and wonderful. Yeah. Can I add to but this I as think... well? The voice eh? note that they put out, yeah, is a conversation I actually had with Ginger and Tony nine months prior to her putting it public to Danny Tom, uh, Danny Roscoe to cut and shut. Why did Are it you take her nine they, months to they, put it public? They sat on it for nine months and just choose yeah. the, the actually time when they want to use it. Yeah. Exactly. Terrible. Terrible. So that went on when uh, Smithy was accusing me is of she being jumping a on? She's, she, oh, she's still <laughs> uh, typing. Come on, Ginger. Oh, Tony. Yeah. Like they created that narrative. And they, I'm not going to argue with that. somebody in the chat. So you either come on or you don't. If you don't come on, I won't talk about you. And, and we'll talk about something else. I can't be dealing with this. So Tony, if you don't That's come it. on the chat, people will only question why you won't come on and talk with us because you've got an yeah. issue of what we talk about. Don't be a coward. Yeah, you've got... Come on. Ginger. We've got questions. You won't answer it. Explain. Come on, Mrs. Collins. Stop smearing us. You know, you've got so much to say. And, you know, now that you're in uh, direct contact with um, Jupiter and you're getting Jupiter to push out all the dirty work, it would be quite interesting for you to answer the. The, the you know that these guys questions I, I don't understand what you're saying well, why 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 are you why are you worried at all i don't understand nothing to be worried about apparently we are the ones who are worried Clown, how much involvement did tony have with lizzie did and stuff um lizzie dead and what yeah. tony yeah well at least that is different um thing <laughs> Oh, be careful because I'm meant to be fucking Lizzie Deed and I mean I've never <laughs> No, no, you're not, but you I did hear this basically. So you are think you are related according to them, you are real well, according to Jupiter, you are related to Lizzie Dead and fiance or husband at this moment. No, I'm not. Yeah, I know yeah, 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 yeah. Because there's the same the same surname which allegedly you have and he have. Um obviously uh, that is the allegation. Now um it's just weird, isn't it? Uh, you know, and then I was, uh, I was Lizzie Dearden. Um, so if you are related to Lizzie Dearden, can you just tell her to give me a ring, please? <laughs> I've got something <laughs> to talk to her about. No, I can't because I don't know. Lizzie Dearden, I certainly don't know. Um, <laughs> once I put an avatar up of a, a, a woman with long red hair, right. And I was running around with this avatar, and it was based Welshman. I don't know if you've heard of him, right? But yeah. based Welshman said to me, "What are you doing, Wendy? Running around with an avatar of Lizzie Dearden? That's how much I know Lizzie." Dearden. No, was was uh, it's all all about your your surname. So basically, what they uh, when they asked, well, when was all that situation with Lizzie Dearden? When they asked me basically about the research, when they asked literally, they put the appeal. They would put appeal to find out information about Lizzie Dearden and Pianza. Once Tommy already was arrested, they put this up in 15 minutes after he's actually arrested on the front of Lizzie Darden flat building. Now, obviously, I did even question basically, I did ask, is that no related to basically Wendy Wu? Because the same surname, and she said, no, no, definitely no, we know all about this guy, oh. blah, blah, blah. So, why, why are you asking, why are you asking all the people for all the information about the guy? So, the, when you put this all chronologically, what happened that night, Tommy, he had information where Lizzie Darden leaves, and he actually left this to the last minute and he went in there to blackmail her. Obviously, he went yeah. too, too late because. He went to blackmail her, but that wasn't up to her because the article was already finished. That wasn't up to her to release the article. Up, that was up to her editors. So I don't understand why this guy actually went to blackmail her it when that was in the hands of the editors. Exactly. It's just these, these people are weirdos, seriously weirdos. But when you always you have to put chronologically what happening around the team, Tommy, what they're doing, what the action, then picked up basically and a newspaper when they're reporting and they're putting the timing into a timestamp when he was arrested, what time police comes in and all stuff. And that's where you will see the whole truth, absolutely whole truth. But again, I see that she is sticking it out, isn't it? Because she got so much to say in the chat, but she can't really say this in the voice, can she? Well, exactly. I, I well, mean, can I, can I, can I, I find it mighty disrespectful as well. I can understand everything that Clang's saying. Oh, can why, I? Why, 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 you know what I mean? 
as as a Polish person, for 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 what that society did for us, you know, that country did for us during the war. Yes, yeah. But um, they don't know history. I, <laughs> they don't know history. <laughs> you know what I mean? And I, I and I have Polish friends, and I have Polish children that come come to my house to play with my children. I find that you know, a lot of, a lot of um, Polish. Uh, you see, you got me started on the war now. So a lot let's go. Polish, let's talk about war. I love history. I love. I absolutely yeah. love history. A lot of Rush Polish. Um, a lot of uh, Polish guys came over, joined the RAF, mm -hmm. and we're in the actual Battle of Britain. Yep. For, yeah. Yeah. Three or three squad or three or three. Yeah. 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 That was yeah. a brilliant. Have I, I one actually watched the the uh, whole the video documentary by, based on the true facts about the first squadron three or three. Yeah. I literally advise to watch it. It's a, such a brilliant thing. I just can't believe it that they were so crazy. They they've been uh, they've been uh, they've been ordered to actually come back when they went on the battle over the channel. We're fighting with this German. Uh, uh, yeah, they were uh, fearless, yeah. fearless men. Uh, yeah. They've been told to actually come back, and they never come back because they went straight after Germans into the action press to just shot. Them every single one of them yeah, <laughs> because they say if they will let them if they allow them to run away they will come back but if they will shoot them down they will never come back <laughs> yeah well we can thank them guys just yeah like, i i, I did ginger them. because you, you've got everything if you want you know uh, she's saying something about the 800 pound that mandy donated to me I'll, I'll answer that because we're trying to go off the subject we're talking about now i'd rather talk about what we're talking about now but um, I did find it strange because I didn't know if I was playing, being played by by both sides, because yeah, you were feeding me little mean. bits of information, so I didn't know what to do. So I'd rather like step back. Yeah. If you remember, well, I fed the information your, to many your, live streamers. Your, uh, you know, I, you, you not, know, your very first uh, message to me and phone call, which I thought was very strange, was straight after I called Danny Tomo out for sniffing coke. Hmm? You come on to me and called me. So I thought, well, do I play it safe and protect myself and my family? So you fed me stuff. I knew the stuff you were feeding me was already out there in the public domain. And I knew yeah. everything that I was feeding you was out in the public domain. So I thought, well, yeah, I did find it strange Mandy donated me all that money. Listen, why, would one person, yeah. why would one person donate all that money? Ginger, is is there anything to do with you? Then he actually got yeah. donation, and that was a seven hundred pound. That was probably eleven hundred pound from what I remember. But it's nothing to do with you. And it's if you wanted that, yeah, yeah, it's nothing to do with you. So what is your point? What is literally your point? Is it your jealousy then actually to try and find that got this money, not actually Danny Roscoe? Danny Roscoe does not deserve even for penny because he does absolutely nothing. And whatever he he says, he literally embarrassing himself. His only question into the squadron three or three, which actually he put in the chat, is did we allow them to fly alone? Well, learn the history, then you might not actually answer yourself this this uh, this question because you are dumb as anyone can get. Literally zero zero IQ in Danny Roscoe head. Can I just remind everyone that Danny is a Walt Mitzi as well? Avina has the messages to prove this. He's a what, darling? What, what was that? Walt Mitzi. Uh, oh, a Walt Mitzi. Someone came. Someone came yep. Ah, right. Uh -huh. Ginger oh, yeah. Tony, you yeah. had your chance to jump on. Just, just go disappear, seriously, because you're just embarrassing yourself. Same like Roscoe. Just, I literally don't see the reason why you're in here. And if you won't basically put anything out, just put anything. Jump on, put anything out, put it across us, and code us on the lights. But you can't because you know exactly you're gonna get destroyed. So well, how about you will just go and have a sniff? Look, clown. She's proved that she's not up for a a, no. a, a debate or a discussion no. calmly, right? In any way, she would just want yeah. to go on Jupiter's and slag. Maybe it. she's pissed, doesn't it? Maybe she's pissed, maybe she's cooked or whatever. Saturday, that's why Saturday she doesn't want to. Saturday night. It's Saturday, yeah. She got us. And they told me not winning anything. So they're on the the on the attack in the powder at us this this weekend, you know. How do you so afford all this powder? How do you afford uh, all this powder, by the way? How do you afford all this powder? Wow. Well, she does not work legally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's just running some <laughs> some self employment thing, but she does not recording all the income. So, I know. Well, this, the don't know, maybe does Tom's not connections to the Canadians. Mm. Hang on, and wait, wait, Roscoe just <laughs> put this right, so I'm a bit confused. When you went in, when you went in the fight with the Germans, was it authorized? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> you see, 
This person, Rush he wants going. to lead, lead the movement. He wants to lead Rush the going. revolution. Come on the live stream. Come on the live stream. <laughs> no, what is he he, uh, on, so he thinks you were in the in the back of Britain, Cloud? Yeah, of course I was. <laughs> <laughs> I was. Well, someone who thinks World War One is in nineteen thirties, and he obviously was, still thinks we're in World War Two. I was flying the Concorde. <laughs> yeah, Cloud's got the DFC. <laughs> you was it authorized? Well, play, you know oh, what I mean? Rosco, come on the live stream, mate. Come on, we're, we won't bite. Just be careful. He's we'll be, he'll be nice. Bombing. Be careful, he, he's pond bombing, isn't he? Uh, he'll go, I won't let him come on the live stream because he'll go and knows exactly what will happen. Well, it's just man, it's just this guy, it's just like I just can't. Do you know, uh, seriously, the last thing I thought I'd see was Danny when I mentioned the Polish uh RAF fighters that Danny Roscoe would be saying clown was in the was there and was the author. <laughs> Well, I, I, I've been everywhere. I would say that I, I, I've been everywhere. <laughs> well, aren't you supposed to be part of the Gambinos and all? <laughs> yeah, he did say. Then I was part of the Gambinos, oh, yeah, selling heroin. Yeah, I was selling <laughs> heroin and this and that. Hmm. Yeah. Is that heroin again, white or brown? Then again, clown, don't worry, because I'm part of Mossad. You know, <laughs> all these actually, things get thrown around. I did done some some research. I, I was learning some history about obviously into this conflict between the Israel and then Palestine and the, obviously the Mossad thing. You know, the Mossad is only the one of the fifth of the whole intelligence services. Actually, part of the intelligence service of the Israel, the whole yeah. the whole Israel intelligence services. There's just Mossad. It's just like tiny little thing. There's like five different agencies which they're all built into one. And they're mm. all calling this Mossad. Why are they not calling the whole the intelligence agency? Just only this little Mossad. Crazy, isn't it? Mm. It's worth looking into. <laughs> it, 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 it is, Matt. Uh, Danny, Danny's on his way out. He said, give him half an hour. He's out of there, so he must be given a school coat or something like that. He doesn't want to come on the oh. live stream. He's got issues no, he wants to want talk to. about. It. He's, he's, talking about it. he's talking about, you know, filming it and, and the drugs and where it comes about it, you know. As filming in London, I met a lot of live streamers who yeah. actually were nobodies that latched on to me because I had quite a following before I even imagined. Little... Yeah, they all latched on, but we were all out. Then... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those sort of people. <laughs> then, then you, then you had the, the like the subject access and just in the <laughs> those sort of people. They all latch on to you because they see you becoming popular. They want a little bit of that, but it's quite funny. You're talking about drugs, right? There were I I and I trusted everybody and I wish I filmed a lot more than I ever did. Yeah. Right? Because it would put you know, I was seeing all these live streamers, you know, off camera discussing um what they're doing with the donation money. I seen them getting into Ubers, you know, in London, calling an Uber, right. driving around. Uh, and then coming back and being dropped off in the same place. Clearly, it's a drug deal going down. Because well, yeah. you just go around the block, and I know that you know. And, and they're all you know spending their donation money that people think that they're given for a worthy cause on, on drugs. You know, so why I is it that, such that, a big that's thing? the kind of thing that made me turn? Yeah, that all of that kind of thing. Yeah. I'm a bit like you, Tyrant Finder. I, I didn't know anything about anything, really. And then you learn, don't you? And once you've learned, you can't yeah. unlearn it. Yeah. No. I, was, I was amongst them while they're doing all the drugs. You were the what, love? You were... I, was amongst, I was amongst these people while they were doing the drugs. Oh, right. Okay. I mean, quite a few live streams that were going on in London, being amongst Ginger Tony and that. So they can't deny I've that. Certainly, I I've certainly been amongst in it, amongst it when I was in Dover and the places like that. That's how but, I come across you. Um, you know, I'm certainly amongst that, but I can get categorically tell that the only drug that I do is smoke, it, and I freely admit that. I think that's because nobody's it. got anything really on tyrant. To, you know, I've had it tried. You know, I've had. I did it around them, and I. You know, they. they they push it. You know, a random picture put out once of me and a girl and a caption saying a picture paints a thousand words. 
you know, no context, no nothing, and the picture was purely innocent. You know, it's when they try and destroy you with their their, their little mm. bits of, of, and it's weird because I find it is actually uh, the, the the more the more dirt they've got on you, right? Right? If, yeah. if they won't talk about you, um, no. <laughs> No, the more dirt you got on them, they, oh, no, I can't think of the word I'm trying to fucking say now. Um, I've lost me trailer for. I, the I more dirt you got on them, the more they will try and scare you into not saying nothing. Yeah, well, they've got nothing on me, and they can. They've got nothing. Oh, yeah, then they make up when, stuff, yeah, and then when they, you in exactly. private. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. They will make up. They will go up more after you if they haven't got nothing against you. If they have something against you, they will blackmail you That's to it. be silent. And if they yes. haven't got anything to uh, against you, they will just literally trigger every single troll, every single vulnerable person. Exactly. To just go after exactly. you. And they're just well, doing the, the Gabbard's Gabbard theory, isn't it? Well, look at how go I admit in contacting your employer. Oh yeah, speaking, but and then going on she about didn't stars, done, she, and all that. She didn't you know? done any bad to me. She didn't done any bad to me. She, she exposed herself. It got to me. Yeah, she exposed herself, but she, she didn't. She put it public. She, she, she didn't affect me. About That's it. the whole thing. She didn't affect me. She actually made my life even better. <laughs> That's the whole thing. <laughs> But the thing is, they brag about what they accuse the people that they're up against doing. It's like, yeah, and if you look into the dope. panel drama, in the panel drama, Tommy, he did um, he did uh, use uh, one guy called James something. That guy, apparently he was telling the story, then his employer was actually contacted by Hold No Hate because his political views or his comments into something wasn't really taken lightly by the Hold No Hate. Now, he used this guy to build his own support and basically the whole hate against the Hold No Hate, right? But then... Mm. On the other hand, his, his cohorts, his people which they're acting on his behalf, they're doing this exactly to everyone who dare to question Tommy Robinson. Yeah. See, it's, it's all the same thing. But like I said, they, it's all we will. About and, labeling it. It's one. Yeah, we did learn. We did learn one thing in the basically whole this three years dealing with them in the, on the other side. Mm. They, everything what they do, they're actually making your life even better. Yeah. And the more they go at us, the more they will regret it. And yeah. it's going to keep so, going on and on and on. So whatever they do or try and put out about me, keep fucking doing it because you're only going yeah. to push me to wind you up more and put yeah. out more. They, they went for, for your job. You have better by You literally are in the better yeah. position than you was three years ago and with them. Mm. They went for my job. I was living in a van. A... I was living in yeah. a van on the beach on the weekends and I worry for five days a week. Even Danny Roscoe still brags that I still live homeless. It's like I yeah. thought you were against homelessness. Yeah, it's and like, then, you know, the same thing they try to do to me, and they, they don't literally even improve my life so much, so much, mm. that I can't thank them enough. So I do really invite them to keep going after us and keep doing as much as they can to us, keep contacting our employers and all that stuff, because every single time we're going higher and higher, our lives improved. So mm. thank you. <laughs> That was it just gives us more of a spotlight as well to their audience, mm. and their audience will get mm. sick and tired of them. But they they're going on about that. We're enticing it all, and there they are. Do, mm. Are the donations still pouring into them? Or, you know what I mean? Why? No. Why? <laughs> How many pegs I mean? in a year now, Clown? Email pegs? Hmm? How many email um, pegs? It's over asking? 80. It's over 80 now. Oh, She's yeah. Like, it's like over 80. Said, <laughs> if, 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 you know, if they're going to answer any questions, they've got to answer the questions that I want to answer. And, you know, the bus. They can't. They can't. They can't. Um, you, you, That's you why know, she didn't join in. All of that. As a complete outsider, they didn't know who, who, who was telling me the truth. They can't because even even they do not uh, agree with Tommy Basky doing this way, which he's doing. They can't really say, "Oh, sorry, he fucked it up in here." Oh, sorry, because he will not like it because he claimed the right to actually say if he fucked it up or no. But he will always say, "Oh, yeah, well." There was always claiming that if he if he realized that he done something wrong, he will actually make it right. But he never actually make anything right anyway. So. That's the reason why Ginger Tony she didn't jump on. That's the reason why they can't debate well, she's us asking because they have no answers. But she so don't want Ginger, to jump on. If, if you want to ask answer questions, then why don't you come on the panel and answer our questions, and then you can ask your questions. It's just simple. You've got an issue with what we're doing. 
You're smearing us. So come on. Talk to us like adults, like grown ups. And why did why did Tommy Roscoe never wants. get involved? Why did Tommy never go to go to Dover or get involved in in Dover? I personally think is because active and little yeah. bits and didn't want him involved. Well, they didn't want to, uh, them to jump on their, you know. Yeah, what they were kind of, kind of, but. There's a I did dig, when I was digging around basically Dover Active and all that stuff and basically there's reasons. Um Active and um and uh, Nobby, they've been invited to actually go in there by um Vinnie Sullivan, isn't it? By TR um the reality report. Um, and I'm not saying that active and little veteran mm, haven't, you know, mm. highlighted some things, you know, that I would have never known it was going on if it wasn't for the likes of active, you know. Oh yeah. Oh, and, yeah. And it, I'm not I, you know, I'm not being nasty, but there are questions. Everyone's got to be accountable. If you are yeah. on YouTube yeah. and you choose to put your life out there, hmm. okay, or what you're portraying as your life, you hmm. have to be prepared to answer questions. Of course. You've got to accept a form of criticism, constructive criticism. How are you going to improve hmm. if you won't accept criticism? And this is the That's thing with Danny Roscoe. He won't accept criticism. You question him what he's doing, he will attack you. You know, he originally was questioned by Mandy about someone who's been racist towards her religion uh, and then obviously the donation with yourself and he just went off on one again he's saying he will not jump on then in a half an hour he will jump on because he's not he's away he's out basically but he's just keep posting in the in the comment chat isn't it yeah. it's just they like, just won't come on clown it's no. like they, they will talk about us they'll smear us but they won't talk about what we're posting what's winding them up they, come on they, they, they we won't bite you guys they are ginger tony danny roscoe come on the chat Mm -mm. They won't come on. They are afraid. You know, and I was filming up in London, <coughs> for, for, you know, for a long time during lockdown, and I, I met Hat and Tash in, in and spoke to Hat and Tash a, a lot of times it, when mm. she did speakers week after week after week. I wouldn't call her my friend, but I speak to her. We know of each other. Yeah, mm. the day that he, you know she got attacked, and the vet, a few days later, Tommy turned up and then got arrested. You was, was there. there. I was there. Yeah, I was, was there, there as well. I was behind you, literally behind you when, uh, when Tommy uh, shake uh, your hand, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I wanted, I wanted to shake his hand. If you got it, you watched the video. I think it's still on. I know. The video, Tommy, yeah, you did shake your hand, to... but yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know the background of the story when he was arrested? He was told uh, the day before that if if police will basically believe that the Muslims they they will be marching towards the speaker's corners to actually get him, the police will actually storm in and arrest him. Even if they have to arrest him for his safety, they will arrest him to yeah. take him out from the speaker's corners. So that yeah, surprised, allegedly surprised he was him. arrested, and I've got it on camera. Yeah, he was. Arrested he was arrested. For, yeah, but uh, for his own safety, uh, uh, and he was told about no, it. No, he, he's saying a weapon. Yeah, directed to my camera. Mm. Well, you know, we yeah, all know. He, he was arrested, but he knew about it a uh, day before that he's going to be arrested. But obviously, they've done the, all the drama for donations purposes and, you know, just to show the police in the bad light, isn't it? Well, it looked so, a bit weird because I went to many protests like that prior and it didn't look like it did that day, you know, with the police and everyone. No. Like that. You, you know, and no biggie. I don't think Tommy's that big a person in the world. You know, no. In, in, no, in, no. But, no. You know, in every, in, not even <laughs> even in 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 normal terms, is a, a normal working man. Uh, I did actually Tommy, check they it. They just let him get on with it. Yeah, they did let him. They're using him for basically whatever they want to use him. But uh, I did check it because Babs, he she, she did accuse uh, me today of lying. Then Tommy is number twenty on the uh, terror most dangerous world, world's most dangerous dangerous extremist. And she said he was, and he's never, no, well, he's not anymore on this list. So I did check it today. He still is, according to new update from 2024, from January, he's, he's still number 20 on that list. So No, not done. How many times did Tommy go in and out of the country? Because... No, they tried to hijack lockdown, but the, the freedom movements, they literally pushed them away. They said they don't want to have nothing to do with him, and they don't want him to actually step in. He try, they tried to do it this with their official voice, but the official voice no, didn't no, run no, by... No, 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 what, what, what he said was, how many times did Tommy go in and out of the country during bloody Oh, yeah, 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 oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, that one, yeah. Yeah, he was quite often, eh? Yeah. 
<laughs> and you need a and you needed a pass, can, a proper can pass, and it just won't get into the not move without farting, without getting, <laughs> nah. you know. Uh, so he's vaccinated. He's vaccinated as well because he needs a pass to get into the Spain at the time of the lockdown. Yeah, that's what that's what kept annoying me when I was yep. watching him go in and out of the country. I thought you've got to be vaccinated at that time. Yep. You had to be. He was a hypocrite. We called yeah. it out on the team. They denied it, and then we showed them the law in Spain. What, you have what to have that, pass. Yeah. What about that owning the uh, property as well in Spain? That is another reason why they let him go in. Yeah, but at the time you couldn't get into Spain without yeah. being vaccinated. Yeah. So he yeah. was uh, lying. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, whether I mean it's your pro choice. Pro choice oh. is your choice if you take the vaccine. Yeah. But he was yeah. slating vaccinated people off on his yeah. own channel. And then he was in hospital in Spain slating an NHS off in Spanish gowns about mm. a blood clot on his leg. Yeah. And then um maybe he have a and some special diplomatic pass. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah! Oh, oh, was that what the problem was with the leg? I didn't know it was that. Oh right. Yeah. Mm. yeah oh, he slated the NHS, NHS off in that post. But again, he slated the NHS, but he didn't pay to the system. So why is he slating NHS? <laughs> he never oh, paid to the oh, system. Yeah. Yeah. So if you didn't pay to the system, why are you expecting the free free action pass in the NHS and free treatment? If the immigrants, whatever they're coming on the basic boats, whatever thing is and anything else, if they, according to him, they can have any free NHS treatment, why he was expecting having a free NHS treatment? Because what? Different passport or different skin color or what? <laughs> Why does it just mean things like that? that? I just makes you think. No, you can't. Mm. You've got to. You. You. It, it's. Uh, you know. I. I've, I've traveled the world and this, that, and the other. You know. I've been lucky enough, but to. To obviously be able to be entitled to anything that England provides, Great Britain mm. provides, you you can't spend that long outside the United Kingdom. Yeah, you know, you've got to be paying tax some in one one another country. You know, when I was working in in other countries, I was paying tax in their country, like in mm. Germany, in places in Austria, I was paying tax there. So he, the reason why he's coming back is because of obviously entitlement purposes, I believe. Yeah, and then he can stand uh, stay in Spain for quite long. He has to come back, I think, every six months or every. Yeah, he can. He, really yeah, he has to come back. Really so that's what he's doing. He's just coming back in here for two, three weeks, causing a mayhem, going back in there. You know, just seeing what is happening, then coming back again, causing a mayhem, going back again in there. And that's what he's doing, literally. But he again, he's saying it's for the safety of his children. No, it's not for the safety of the children. You literally putting your children into much more danger. Than you did mm. before when you wasn't here. Because when you wasn't here, if you actually pissed off people, people will go after you. If you're not in here, if you pissed off people, people will want fly to the Spain after you. They will actually go after your family. Simple as that. Yeah, but I, I'd like him to become an expat and go go live there for good. You know, just not come back. That would. Be I like him to go to jail and experience this what he experienced before. Aye, <laughs> <laughs> right, but this time he not come a... out two million pound richer. Well, in the jail, well, yeah, there is that, isn't there? There's not many people which. Yeah, but is all it's true. See, I, see, I, I, I'm, I'm on the fence. Is all, you know, is this all hundred percent? You can, can we all prove that Tommy works for the state? Oh, you know, he's all part of it. He, he was just put in jail and then given two million quid to just go away silently and blah blah blah, blah sit in, sit in solitary confinement, blah blah. blah. Really Had his own gym, in his own little room. And he could sit and talk to the to the screws as he calls them and, and to uh, what's his name, you know Grant what? Mitchell, his tenders. Yeah, he did an yeah, interview yeah. with him. Oh, it's, all yeah, like, yeah. it's just so blatant now when you look at the whole picture. It's like yeah. how the hell did we not see this at the beginning? But yeah. we 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 were put here for a reason and it's to expose what we've witnessed. And they don't like well, the fact that we've got the bollocks to do it. He's, he's facing he's facing two years in prison right now and does the maximum prison sentence for the silence video, right? Now, we know the evidence is he admitted on the live streams then he did send this to the lots of different journalists or whatever. So he did admit he released this video, risking that it's going to be released into the wider public. So now, if he will get a slap on the, basically on the back and he will get like one month, two months suspended, you know exactly why it's done. Now, after basically his previous conviction, he's supposed to get now maximum prison sentence, at least one and a half year till two years. If he's not going to get that, you have your all answers if he's working for state, if he's making any deals or not. Now, there's mm. no many things what people know before, but the reason why he's put in the solitary, uh, solitary mm. confinement is because he's been done in jail twice. He literally admitted this to one of his ex-members 
then they got into him when he was lifting the soap. So um, that is one of the reasons, obviously, he reported that and that they're using all of that constantly just to put him into conf uh, the solitary confinement because obviously they go into his back side. And uh, I'm, I'm, even point, I'm even at the point, you know, when he was outside of Leeds, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I watched that live. And everyone went nuts. I mean, I even think that that was a setup. I'm sorry. It was. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Oh, oh, Wendy. I oh, haven't looked back at that I was just thinking the same thing. When you look on this now, yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. That's how it, that's really how it all started. To when you look on all of it yeah. now, all the situations yeah. and then how much money he was earning afterwards, it's just like, and how much fame there was, was giving him. Well, he had 30, 40,000 people in the street, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. I was watching. Look at him now. <laughs> yeah, free Tommy demos. That was like 600,000 people on the on the streets, isn't it? Yeah, free yeah Tommy. exactly. Yeah. It's but like the... when I was watching that that day when he was outside of the... I thought, this mm. is... This is something you know, about... the thing is, right. Tommy never delivered. He never yeah, delivered. I, I, he never... I, I, he never... I, uh, the Lucy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know why she reached out to me a long, 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 long time ago and I ignored her when they did the video, the Dover video. And then she had all that hassle about getting it taken down, the strike about accreditation. And I was warned to get it off of my channel as quickly as possible because there's strikes going out left, right and centre and like prosecutions yeah. and this, that and the other. And, you know, and I just basically, you know, closed my decks down. You know, protected myself and in in and you know, and it, it, you know, I feel sorry for her. It's yes. actually to me and what I've seen, the you know, the blatant truths it put out that Tommy did Is this invite what... a certain person to the day of freedom. Yeah. Ali that was yeah. so this Jupiter yeah. Jupiter was talking about it on one of the her latest streams and th she did admit that Tommy did invite the Ali Dawa and he did backed off. He did un uninvite Ali Dawa. If you remember how the, he dumped Lucy Brown, he did said because she invited him with, uh, and without his knowledge. Now, even Jupiter, she admitted that that was Tommy, and he just literally couldn't handle and he couldn't face his basically his his uh, supporters. So he blamed basically put the blame on the Lucy uh, Brown. That was his biggest mistake, which he actually done. Then he dumped. Uh, Lucy, Kaylan, and George, because they was yeah. the architects of his fame. Yeah, and yeah, 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 yeah. They were the first. Because I'm, I'm more interested person, in the people. Sorry. sorry, the first person to tell me about Tommy Robinson that he was taking cocaine and that his favorite crisps were cheese and onion crisps, right? Like just everyday things, right? And the cocaine factor, the drugs factor, and what went on um, in a, was was Lucy. Uh, mm -hmm. via direct me messages in, in Twitter. And mm -hmm. this was, well, uh, when he got her, I think it was, um, oh, Jesus. It was after that Day of Freedom thing. And Lucy was really angry, really, really upset mm -hmm. and angry at him. Uh, and she was telling me all these things. Like, apparently, I mean, I don't know you guys if you know, but, you know, the best thing he loves to do is to rush home sit down and, and look at twitter all day and eat cheese and onion crisps and then take a mm. bit of cocaine <laughs> yeah yeah so lucy after that what they did they triggered the trolls like richard imam ginger tony Helgauer, and all of them they started the massive hate campaign towards lucy yeah. blaming her for everything they literally was was um trying to make people to go after lucy so lucy she did document this and she did actually opened up some uh website mm -hmm. where she put the all the evidence all the screenshots there's a thousands of thousands of threads yep. against her mm -hmm. it's and we've, just we've, only basically, based on lies. we've shown we've shown publicly again of what they mm -hmm. did to lucy but obviously mm -hmm. not on the level that they did to lucy because mm -hmm. there's someone that's just been put to prison for some of the things that were sent to her yeah Two, two and people. I've seen what was sent to her. It was dirty, dirty, dirty pictures. Honestly, mm. it's like wow. And this is a mate yeah. Tommy Robinson as well. Yeah, I'm not so, even being scared um, about on his channel. And and the fact is now it's coming out that it was Tommy who lied at the time. So this is the man who is pretending that he's a 
he's a patriot he's a for the grooming victims he's for the women's he's for the women's rights he's for this and that and that right but this man was such a coward that he couldn't be a gentleman and just cover for lucy just literally stand on the front of her so listen even if i say then she's wrong you are not entitled to actually threaten her because she's a woman she, he didn't he couldn't even have this courage that's such a coward he is because it's what she knows remember lauren southern well he was no there's a bit different story there's a there's a background story into this why he dumped her he basically he used the situation actually to dump her get rid of her because jenna so jenna was suspecting that there's something some affair going on between him and lucy uh which was and obviously the kiss once in taxi uh, but that wasn't basically a thing like that. Tommy had a lot of different outside of the marriage affairs behind Jenna's back, but with the different sorry, different people uh, with the with different guys. And almost everywhere where he gone, he actually scored some guy. That's what he was literally doing. And um, finally, this um, I don't remember her name, Jasmine. Jasmine, she basically she was involved with um, Tommy in some outside of marriage uh, sexual affair. And just mean she really want to just mean by the way she was uh, dating uh ronaldo or one of high ranking footballers and uh, she wanted basically stay with tommy so she tried to actually destroy tommy's marriage and she got in touch with jenna and she told jenna about at least 15 other girls so jenna she went nuts <laughs> she went nuts and that, at that point his marriage actually ended oh right yeah they've been all together because obviously kids and money and all that stuff but that at yeah, that yeah. point everything ended and then they went through the basically this divorce just well jenna she used this jamal case and the bankruptcy case just to get rid of him and successfully she got rid of him uh, obviously and she got in control of all money majority of the money majority of the houses a part of all of it was invested by tommy's brother because there's tommy's brother who is not really mentioning anywhere. That the one the premier in the Yeah, he's got in um he's got in um he stepped in um when Tommy been arrested in Leeds and when all of this money was start coming from lots of different angles. Um, Why do we even refer to him as is Tommy? No, it's um, Stephen. Why do we call him by his first name? Because you know he's knows in love with Stephen as well. His brother-in-law is Stephen as well, or Steve, Stephen, oh, right, Stephen. Okay. Yeah. So I think you know, I think not to confuse people because people were yeah. saying, "Oh, that's not about Tommy; that's about someone else." So let's, yeah, let's but go is here. it? Ah, oh, right. Okay, Steve, Steve. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right. yeah. yeah okay. He's got. He got. I think he's got four or five different legal names, by the way, Tommy. Right. So we need to take that to account. <laughs> it was just someone's um, comment in the chat. It's just like. Is oh, I saw that one. Name? Paul Harris. Paul Harris. Paul Harris. Yeah. We go, I think we got four or five different names basically stated, and we actually found the limited companion on all of these names. <laughs> yeah, well, as, open, close, open, close, open, uh, close. Uh, as a person, you know, <laughs> who knows how the algorithm works, and they, you know, and they can cut cut any traffic to you. They don't, they won't promote you or anything like that. Mm. But, or, you know, I, 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 I was suppressed. I believe I was suppressed. I believe I could have been a lot bigger than what I was. Or I yeah. am, um, but yeah. But for somebody to go off and not really post anything of importance and get all the views that you get, you know, paid is all bought. If you will see, his... it has to be. Yeah, Telegram channel, but, but obviously he had hundred fifty thousand, and with the hundred fifty thousand, yeah, but... he got twenty thirty thousand views, which obviously mm -hmm. is including the, all the shares into different channels. And if you will look on his, his reaction and the comments, this just like less than 50, less than 100. This, this, <laughs> Sometimes this, he got yeah. actually like 500, 600 reactions, but he's like I say, he's he's the guy claiming about the free speech, but he blocked a lot of negative reactions, emojis on his own channel. <laughs> Yeah, we got right. the wee ones to do the same, Garrett, yeah. these years as well, you know. Yeah, it's like all of them, all of them. It's it's like, look at the them. views we're getting. I go, you look at your reactions you get, and you shut all your bad emojis down. You won't allow yeah. no comment or chat to go on, because we've named it that only two because people are commenting. Yeah. It's because like, people you're trying to make yourself shit, famous. Shit, shit, shit but, reaction but, was but having why big it, Getting on to the likes of Lee Garrett, if you can. Oh, because he's being he's being used by the battle of the ego. Oh, so, that's no, all it is. But, but, they no, want to be big. Why, why all of a sudden they've jumped on the Yulees, the 
whole Lee Garrett, Mark Steele. Money, you lads, money oh, making. Well, I know this. It's, it's the, number, yeah. the number plate, the number plate thing. It's yeah, yeah. Well, you only jumped on it and only bragged about making four hundred and eighty quid or something. It's like, well, you just expose yourself on your own channel, you twat. But yeah, then, then Mark he... Steele mm -hmm. did an interview to the to the <laughs> Times, mind you, the Times, saying oh. it was the cameras are. A photo <laughs> laser, on, yeah. Photo on laser that it's gonna kill <laughs> some death weapon, ray, mm. some sort of yeah. death ray. Yeah, so he's painting everyone no... this protesting for the tax. You know, this big massive tax for going in there, uh, London. He just he tried to discredit it. Yeah, he's mm. discredited it. I believe. You know, that yeah, the but... it's a death ray. The oil the, the shit goes around saying that he he's got experience in weaponry and that he's got no proof of it. He he was a bar doorman who had a gun and shot someone oh, and accidentally someone. caught a woman in the face and disabled her for life. He's a con man. She was, she was a girl. She was a girl. She was a child. She was a child. Yeah, they they all yeah. con men. They just all all. But There's no history of military is... background. Yeah, they are all the little ones. But what I'm saying is the very important thing to expose Tommy was because Tommy was the main guy who actually showed everyone the way, how to do it, how to con the public, how to divide, how to work on well, the got, and actually make a million. Well, I find a lot of the followers Miller that give a lot of money. Mm. It's like Jonathan Miller and the Naga and all the connections of all the people. You've got like sort of mixed stock of Gardens 300 that's connected to them. And you've got Dean Cumberpatch also. So connected to him through the company's mm. house. It's like they all know each other. They all know each other. They all we said it from day the one. same group. It's one, yeah, one big pot with different audiences. And, and they, they the funny the thing is because they used to be fighting each against each other. Everyone divided. Exactly. But look, they used to be fighting against yeah, each other. Yeah, but now they're all against when, me and when you. They, yeah, when when they's grant is base, basically being weak and they they go fire, they call the fire and all that stuff, and they got problems. They all uniting, they all uniting, and then once they got but, the bit of safety, they they still fighting against each other apparently, and then they again they they just uniting again, fighting, you know, just trying to survive together, and then and then again they fight each other. Look back on man, you know, it's like. The, 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 anything you say about them or post about them, they, they shared it on their own channels. It's like, oh, this is going to be easy to expose them then. You, you know, <laughs> I've got them to expose themselves on their own channel. I've got Ginger Tony to go to my work and post a video. Hmm. You know, you, you just created that content for drama. You didn't really come to my work to do anything with me because you know you've been caught Same in your today. own paper trails. Same yeah. today, she jumped to the to the chat and she basically flapping around all that stuff. She's saying, "Yeah, I will jump come on. In. Why you worry? Why you worry? Why you worry? I will jump on. Why you worry?" Okay, but she made a then. post about going <laughs> to Mandy Mosby's local pub, but she just turned up, didn't ask, didn't say nothing, no warning given, and then bragged uh -huh. that she went there and walked away. It's like, uh -huh. what are you trying to put out publicly? Because all you're doing is showing yourself up that you're all about fucking violence, not about uh -huh. solving issues or I questions say, I, that that's, that's you have an issue about we put public. It is. It's, it's a intimidation. There's a threat. It's intimidation. intimidation. Sorry, yes, yeah, intimidation, which is it, which is a form of a threat. Yeah. But you can see in the comment section and on Jupiter's side that none of these people are actually interested in the truth. All they're interested in doing no. is no. defending Slander. what these Slander. people are doing and accusing other people of doing too. Yeah, but so what they're doing is exposing themselves. You need to understand. But this is it. It's like it's it's like the, every time they're asked a question in the chat. They come back with your baby Reflection. beater there. Yeah, you do. You die. Yeah, right? it's, but it's whatever nonsense. you did in your past, and if you're guilty of it, I hope you're fucking thoroughly ashamed of it, right? <laughs> and I hope you paid your price for it, right? If it's not true, then you know what I mean. It's, but, it's, yeah, well, you're more than welcome to ask me. Anyone. You know what I mean? They've shown me nothing but you, you're proving Tyrant. you know everything about you they're showing me no hard evidence exactly no and if he, no has, he has he has he you know me because they putting this as a uh, they putting this in the way then people when they listen to it or reading it they're saying fucking hell that's a, such a crime what can he i mean why can he, I just why say he wasn't why he wasn't arrested, why? why he wasn't prosecuted, why he wasn't in jail, why he wasn't this, why they can't provide anything to actually prove that something literally happened, not some kind of screenshot taken yeah. from anyone yeah. else. Because can I, I can say what, in five what they've done, what they've done is they turned my channel more, uh, rather than being against grifters, liars and scumbags, they yeah. tried to get me to be personal on myself on my channel. I was yeah. stupid mm -hmm. enough at first. I posted a history of my, uh, DPS checked enhanced. I was a school bus driver and got enhanced. So therefore, 
children in needs. Oh yeah, because if we're enhanced, yeah, they go into children. I put out I had in, my I had enhanced full well. date of birth, stupid enough, and my original surname. Mm. I put everything about my personal life on that channel, and I all they've done is it, no, and I'm stupid, Wendy. That's what they do. They get you to go personal and make you post everything about yourself. They get you in that state of mind. But now, because they've got no control what I post on my channel, that's why they're doing what they're doing now. They're having to do the dirty work themselves now. Well, I ignore yeah. what they post about me. I carry on doing the what I was originally set up to do on my channel, and that's to post the stuff that I've seen and witnessed or what I've researched along with other people. Mm. Keep it about that. Watch them get angry. Now look at them. They can't even okay, come well, on the live stream, on and off there, they, they, talk to us. That's a point. They, and the people which they follow them, they are just literally shit. Absolutely shit, because they just... So what, why are those bullshit? followers of those people, like Ginger Tony, thinking now that Ginger Tony, Danny Roscoe, or Helga won't come on the live stream with us then? Well, they're what's clapping their, what's their saying, saying, good, that? Good, so they're the going to go to their, their followers and say they're, they're not going to... They're not. Uh, they're calling on. us fascists. Yeah. They're calling us fascists, this, this, but they're I'm posting about fascist. us, and they've well, banned us from their channel, so we can't see knows. what they post about us. Okay, okay. You know, it's so knows. funny they're calling me a fascist. Yet yeah, I can't walk my own city streets without getting attacked every time by Antifa because Bristol's practically been taken over by the woke left and Antifa. You know I, I mean, remember walking down beside you me. with and going against Antifa, and I remember when yeah. I had my phone snapped off me and smashed on the floor as well. And then I got arrested by the flipping police for it because they knew what I was doing. Yeah. I was trying yeah. to record the man, the bald headed guy that was leading it. Yeah, I got spotted by about five Antifa members. They recognized me being a Tommy Todd, and they snatched my phone and smashed it on the floor. Then I got chucked on the floor <laughs> by two police officers. Yeah, I'm not going to accept Tony, uh, Tony running around saying that she didn't come on here. Um, because blah blah blah, right? Because she knows if she'd come on here, I would, I would expect a decent conversation, and I wouldn't allow you know the screaming to go on. As long as it's like this, like it. a chilled out conversation. Yeah, like this. yeah. and exactly. Tony knows this. It's so there was the same no reason. Like the Hell Gower's voice messages and the shit. That she is a granny. She plays victim. She plays yeah. victim. She's a granny, but the vileness and the venom, you can hear it in the tone of voice. I wish you dead. I hope you die. You're such a lonely old man living in the lorry. Oh, I know some yeah. of the trolls uh -huh. that you're with or some I've got of loads of that. today on yours. The same with Ginger Tony. Tony, some about suck a cock or you go get... Go oh, that was to a venom. survivor, by the way. Yeah, I, and they say really, that we speak to survivors really like care. that. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, now uh, that's even more disgusting. But to even use language and talk to people in that tone, of in that manner, I know what yeah. you're saying. Yeah. Oh my so god, I said I earlier, thought, uh, like my dad, my but, dad would have beat me. But dad apparently, would have absolutely battered me. Apparently, they reported us to police for harassing them. <laughs> apparently, but they're posting about us all day were, in the last twenty-four yeah. hours. I think like, like last two years they've been just saying that they reported the police coming, the police coming, the police coming, and the police couldn't come. <laughs> it's just lost on the way. Right. It's like, why is Dave Smith attacking me now? Why is he posting about me? Oh, I remember doing a live stream with him once. <laughs> Back hurt. <laughs> and he got salty when I called him a Tommy Tard. He's like, I'm a Tommy Tard. I admit I'm a Tommy Tard, but at least I've got the bollocks to talk out what I've seen. What about you? I'll put a question to you. You won't answer it. You just you keep see, saying I'm obsessed. He's so in love with Tommy that he can't see. He, he believes that Tommy does nothing wrong at all. You know. Can I ask you so something? He you? Is he is he full time working? Because last I heard he was on a dog. He's not he's, working. No. So why yeah, does he so call him pay, a working class patriot? Him. Because he, why does he call himself work. a working class patriot? Well, that 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 is a good question. But he's now 40, 42 channels, <laughs> Dave, isn't he? I thought he was going to say he's now 42. <laughs> no, he's 42 channels, Dave. That's what he calls himself now. Jesus, really? All, all I'm really interested in, right, if he's this really good man and he's really for his country right, and he wants the best for it, right, any donations he gets, anything he gets from the good, good of the public, because, God, I would love to add the amount that he's got in the past because I could have done so much more. But there's another well, story. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he should be a little bit more transparent because everything that everyone's given to me, I can be transparent. They've come to me, they've asked me. Everything they've given me, I've proven that I've 
done what I said I was going to do with it. Tommy's never he could have started a political never... party. Yeah, he could have started a political party. Charity for the victims. He could actually, even if he doesn't want to do open his own charity, he could actually support uh, so many charities. Even you know, ten grand in here, ten grand in there. You know, for he charity, one of his so plots, much money. One of his buildings for a well, resort for them well, to go well, to. Oh man, and I know, I'm not saying Tommy. You know, I started listening to a lot of Tommy. You know, I, I had to make my own mind up mm. about him. I really got into it when I watched his Oxford Union, really. And Me I too. Learned, Me learned too. About, <laughs> learned about how he grew up and how he said he grew up on the streets of Luton. And, mm. I, knew, and I know, you know, Islam and mosques and things like that really grew in Luton. So, yes, there must have been a lot of cultural tensions during that time. So I must have, you know, I, I, I don't know what is to be true. So I thought, yeah, if he had a, a life like that, what a pretty shit life that is. Now, you know um, I mean? When, uh, when I saw that, when I saw what you're talking about, mm. and I, I started uh, taking more notice of Tommy Robinson, I thought, oh, well, maybe he's smartening himself up. Maybe, yeah, maybe yeah, maybe that always looks, looks like that to be like statesmanship, <coughs> statesman like, and maybe he can't form a political party. And then, like, oh, no. and then all of a sudden, he started running around referring to people as bruv and in it. Um, in it, in it. Can I just jump in, Ginger Tony, Chris Pert? It's amazing what you say regards to Chris when you've been donated eight hundred pounds. Can I just say something? What about Tommy Robinson when he was donated by the Jewish community? Then, then when the Jewish community stopped donating to him, he went against them about the Jewish question. What about Tommy Robinson when he was donated by the Jewish? Then, then when someone's someone's got YouTube on or recording or something, we can hear it. Um. Wendy Wu, uh, how do you have uh, something, I can't read that, wrongings or something, uh, not allowed near kids on your channel? I don't know. There's nobody like that on my channel. I'm sorry. Yeah, but at the end of the day, to be quite honest, to answer being ginger or anything, being a YouTuber and a content creator that knows a lot about technology and camera work, this, that and the other, for, for what Tommy produces... You know, I could produce on a, you know, an iPhone on a camera, but what yeah. he claims to you, you know, yes, microphones and everything else like that, yeah, brilliant to do professional work. Yeah, they all cost money, mm -hmm. right? But where's the receipt for all of this stuff? Well, I'd we like don't see, see them. You, you, no, we don't see them. And I see I've, some, I've some high-end equipment. I've seen high-end equipment, right? Hmm. Y you know, I have seen some high-end, well, not high-end, I... You know, road mics, and I know they're only a few hundred quid. We're talking thousands getting, you know, getting donated, and I don't see anything that what could be, you know, put together. A studio, Jesus Christ, you could put a studio. I found together. the studio. The studio actually did exist. There was a unit, industrial unit, and they built few walls only just to record their marketing thing, and they abandoned the studio, and the Ezra Levant had to actually go back and Ezra Levan had to pay people to actually bring this back into the previous state because yeah. he had to give a lease back. Yeah, well, yeah any damage you do through. to the building, if you're not yeah. through, you've got yeah. to put back. You've and they right. only build a few ones just for ginger, money. Ginger, Ginger, you, you, you've asked the same question again and I've answered it ages, Jump on. ages and ages ago, right? You even said you found it weird getting that donation out of the blue and I said, yes, yeah. I did. I didn't know that I was getting played by both sides. I didn't know who to trust. So I thought, I bet I'm down my ashes. Tell you stuff that was already in domain. You were only feeding me stuff that was already in the domain and I already knew in the hope that I would stop dropping them in the shit. I wouldn't drop nobody in the shit that what I already knew on people. You know what I mean? So, uh, you, you know, I've chosen now. I've seen who the, really the people are. Like I said... I've got everything still on. I bet you've been through your phone already to see where you've spoke to me, this, that, and the other, and what you've got and what thing. It's not deleted, is it, Jim? Well, it doesn't matter if you've deleted the chat oh, and everything in Telegram I don't, I don't now. I'll allow, you, I'll allow you. Yeah, but why does she keep rambling on about an £800 donation? Donation. What the because difference? that's what has her. Bad I don't understand it's if it was distraction from the thing we, we've said about Tommy. In fact, it was more, I believe. In fact, I think it was more. Well, Tommy in a millions. 
she's not questioned this that but can i just address something very important so ginger tony she said what she said in her comment in the in the chat um hold on let me just find it uh she say i prefer to support a grief there than a baby beater now let me address this in the last few months her and her goer, they've been climbing, then we are harassing them. They reported us to police because they are no part of the Tommy and we're still harassing them. Now, she did admit again, a part of obviously her video and that's what Jupiter said on her live stream, then she does actually support Tommy still, then she is a still Tommy supporter, then she's still around the Tommy and she's part of the Tommy Baisky clan. So, Ginger Tony, your comments do not help yourself and do you know how to Tommy? She's trying to blackmail you in the chat she's just exposed herself in the chat public yeah. noise is posted you saying you post my voice notes so i post yours fair she's trying to blackmail saying that if you post any more she's going to post more <laughs> she Tony, you, where, to when to have it. i posted your she, workplace she to, or your details to call a truce now and at you, yeah. you don't post so, anymore on earth yeah and that's it with yeah. your life Ginger but Tony. she hasn't answered anything you know, previously, yeah. you on the chat Ginger, right now. Ginger, <laughs> Ginger Tony, Ginger Tony, you did <laughs> try. To, you did try to dox me today. You ask other people to to try and dox me yes. today. You yeah. did dox my work address with or me or workplace wherever. You did contact my workplace. Now watch what I'm gonna do to you. To, to you, if you if you are trying to blackmail, if you're going to the leftist basically tactics and doing all of that, now watch what I'm gonna post about you. Just watch. <laughs> Because you know me, what I said, I will deliver, and I will deliver you such a surprise. Then you're gonna feel very embarrassed taking your nose out of your doghouse. Ginger, Ginger wants to post everything, you know. I, I, I've got nothing to hide. I've got me too. nothing to hide. Me too, but she's just trying this lefty tactics and anybody, mm -hmm. anybody, they can hear them all. I know which side I stand on now. I didn't, you know, which one at a time I didn't know who I was being played by. See, she's but just I playing know where a personal I stand, game. But, but yeah, now, she's not interested in the question. But, but, but now, I know, where I, I know where I stand. It's like, up, ignore their credit. questions, answer our yeah. questions. Yeah. It's, it's Ginger, Tony, you have, Ginger, Toppy, pop in on the panel and let's talk face to face, well, voice to voice. Come on. She'll expose herself if she don't. Come on, Ginger. You want to basically, you're saying we are lying, we did this, expose us, jump on the panel and expose us. Come on, we're waiting for you. have never heard them asking us. They know all scared year. because they know how big I could have been and everything in London, how I could have, how I marched more people down through London like that in, yeah. in words that was spoken with true heart and meaning, something, yeah. you know what I mean? Everyone else, everyone else reads off a script. I didn't mm. have a script. But look what this posting, it's just like, she can't you know even I mean? post. You can't just anything. What we're saying. You were there. Mm. You were there. You were there. You mark. You. You seen like, what I commanded, and you seen if no. I spoken up and had a little bit more bollocks and being than being. You know. Look how many video clips as shy that, that as I of am. Me with, with what I was on London. What I was doing in London. Yeah. There was a couple of bad clips on like Daily Mail and the Sun when I stood with yeah. the veterans, or one when I had a beer can in my hand with Tommy idiots, which yeah. was a stupid night. But you know what? there's, no, there's many videos of me doing heroic stuff. In the likes of that, I could have been bigger. Oh. But have you have you realized what she's posting? She's just literally not answering to any accusations oh, we're putting on. She just literally put shit. I can, I can still do it. Well, she I knows about the dirty deeds of Danny Tomo and Tommy Robinson. She knows a lot about that. We've you put know, blackmail small. voice messages in her own words, and you know, that's the main mm -hmm. question we want her to answer to. She but knows she what happened rather, in Romania. She knows what happened in Romania. <laughs> I know, she knows, <laughs> she knows that I know, they know that we know. Do, do, do. And it will come out. It will come, come out. out what, 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 I, 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 I keep saying I'm an outsider because I was an outsider for a long time looking in, but now I'm actually having my say and I'm having some bollocks. Hang on, hang on a minute. Right, right. I, just want to, I just want to talk to Dan Tarragon for a minute. Wendy turns a blind eye to what? I have You're told Tony. Yeah, no, it's that Dan Tarragon. Dan Tarragon. That's apparently it? Rick. Apparently, yeah, his name is Rick, something like that. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, he's an idiot. 
Yeah, I did destroy him today in debate on the ghost. I did destroy oh, him. He right, could okay. he couldn't provide anything. He just come in and say, I'm a professional bullshit. I said, Okay, well, in what? And he said, You did claim that Danny Thomas slept with 15 years old. I said, I didn't claim, but if you have a if you think then it was me, provide the proof. And he said, Oh, if not you, then who? I say, Well, I'm not gonna help you. You're doing your shitty job. So you do yourself your research and expose yeah, me if you want. Then I asked him for when... any any other examples and he couldn't provide any other examples and he was just trying to talk over me and all that stuff. I said, Listen, that's that's it, you literally expose yourself. Do you know what? Do you know something? Um, I went to the first rape of Britain. I had probably the most on the live stream, the most views on the video I put up after. You know what I mean? I had thousands. Um, within that, the live stream was struck. I believe it wasn't anyone else. I bet it was probably one of them jealous. That I've I got, got a crusader. Exposure. He's well known for doing that on people's yeah, live streams. Yeah, I got more TWs. exposure than... He did it on Active. He did it on Joe Drayson's. Yeah. He report anything for copyright. That's how he managed to shut down some of the videos I used and exposing the Tommy Robinson Red oh, no, Britain because I used a little whole... bit of his footage. Yeah, yeah I but, uh... rather like Joe Drayson actually because she's been on here a few times, you know, on this panel. Um, Her views yeah. are a bit awkward, but you know, she, she's not done no harm. She's always had good words to say to yeah, me. A lot of like respect, but Ginger yeah, it's a, it's wanted same, me to attack same. her. Same with, same with Joe. Yeah, she's never said anything bad to me, you know. I couldn't no. attack Joe Jason because she was always kind to me, you know. She gave yeah. me the respect. And Ginger yeah, was exactly. constantly saying, yeah. you know, she even asked people to get a video to send to me. There's a voice note of her asking Clownwall or Mandy to ask Clownwall for a video or something on Joe Jason. Yeah. yeah. You know, yeah. to turn me against her. Yeah, look, it's like, um, can I add this? Her, her comment? So she's saying, uh, but it was, uh, uh, it. It's us who got doxxed, right? Hang on, why and, is she talking about Tommy Robinson's ex-wife? What? I don't know, but I'm addressing her, her, her previous comment when she's saying, uh, but it, it's us who got doxxed her sons. That we, uh, What did he do? <laughs> so uh, so when they contact my employer, that was around uh, February, March in 2021, I believe. Now, her son... Uh, obviously, all the situation with her son comes out just just before summer. So that was already three or four months later. Her son. So they did dogs contact my my company. They did dogs and uh, contact ending companies. And now they're using this her son as a reason why they doxed us and they contacted our company. So that is one basic thing. Was I need to straighten up now? She's saying she's saying why was you quoted in the Hope No Hate book? Well, Ginger Tony, because I might actually done such an amazing job that someone actually mentioned me in the book and. You are mentioned as well, but you all have only one line and the bad line. We have a really few lines and quite good lines. So is that why you're bad head or I don't know? <laughs> Just like <laughs> it's weird though. Absolutely weird. It looks like they are all very personal. It's all about because you got bigger mention than her. You got more donation than him. Yeah. You got something it's else. Personal. It's like more personal. I, 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 I did notice with that with Danny, you know, they're always interested. Tommy posts yeah. his um Tommy's trending on YouTube, you know, on uh, yeah, on yeah. X. How I many he's trending? But that's only relevant to the person who keeps on pressing on the tweet. Yeah, you know, it's all down it's to childish. the algorithm. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's childish. It shouldn't it's never childish. be for clicks and views. But this is this is Team it's Tommy. Annoying. This is Team Tommy. This is yeah. what it is. I it's can go out the hell we were involved with. and, and <clears> make <throat> a video, uh, and you know, to trigger the people like that. If I wanted it tomorrow, she, she's just threatening Mandy. She literally threatening she's Mandy now. Look at that. There's a, there's an indirect threat. At, um, yeah. Question about are you yeah. home? Yeah. Is is John there? And I walk over. Okay, Ginger. Let's meet up on the front of Mandy. I will be there. You. And there we go. Your, there your we mice. go. Yeah, you and go. This, if you want to do that way, I will be there. Come on. But if, if, this if, is if exactly why any... the public annoyance channel. You know, showing yeah, the public annoyance. There she is. Sort of knowledgeable. And right. Tony Robinson on law, what she's this. doing there, making direct threat that that is a threat that could yeah. be taken as a she threat. wants a fight. Now, she's now you know offering Mandy a fight, yeah, right. yeah. Ginger, bring your Mackie friendly or whatever your mates, and I will pop in on my own. And Someone let's meet up in front of Mandy's, wine, yeah. You're offering a fight. I mean, really, yeah. Tony, how old are you? It can be classes. Uh, no, uh, she's she's um, two years old, isn't it? Right. It's a battery. She, class is a battery. Actually. She's thrown the dummies out of pram. She's been exposed. And now she don't care what people think yeah. about her. That's she couldn't exactly the jump on the panel and talk and expose us because uh, she's such a coward. Right. But she wants to turn up to the Mandy basically house. So I said, Ginger, if you want to turn yeah. up, I will pop in, bring your mates. I will be alone. I will get you all around. 
or just packed up your well, audio to the bin bags? We did say they can say and do and accuse us as much as they want. Answer the question that she would go live. Now she she giving oh no, Ginger. Oh, I don't Aita, you're jumping live. I promise. I don't threaten. I promise. <laughs> 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 so have a bit of bollocks about you, because Ginger. The iron board has extended its legs. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, you are exposed, Ginger Tony. You have been literally exposed any, as a Trump by yourself. Yeah. No, um, you promise. So whatever you're wanting to come to people's house for, you just got to remember these these I things. Is, is uh, any man's is his ca any English man's <laughs> home is his castle. Where are you from, man? Ginger, if she's you, not. But I am. If, if you if you come onto the question. property anyway, <laughs> and you are outside, so your man man outside. You know so I mean? just so dress just, up. Just, uh, just uh, uh, so so quiet. I'm going, I'm, so I'm going to Mandy for a cuppa. Lord, I'm going to Mandy for a cuppa now. Moderators <laughs> in the chat. They have chat that these got a real channel. I'm so close. To the... Ginger, listen. I'm at home. I'm at home. <laughs> and they know where you live. I'm at home. <laughs> you know where I live, yeah? I'm at home. Come on. You've got no reason to be saying I could go to be coming around somebody's house at quarter <laughs> two in the morning. No. Really? Have you? Desperation. I go good, uh, yeah. good bean bag and the good uh, sleeping brush. So come on. We're just working class people talking online, and this is what yeah. we get by the Tommy yeah. team. Uh, look, Exposed. she's just literally getting off her head, isn't it? <laughs> she's on. She's on the. You know, you know so. something, Ginger. <laughs> I'm sat on Wendy's, and no disrespect to Wendy or anything like that. Would just subscribe. You say I don't leave that. Well, if we took this over to my channel and started to talk about this on my channel. I guarantee oh, you'll be you we'll we'll, 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 we'll be rammed. We'll be rammed packed and we'll be having oh, a lot yeah, more no people. Doubt, love. Yeah, of course. You, know, no, so Chris, you, you come up with a really good idea here. Just be careful there, okay? <laughs> right? so, you know, if, you really, if we really want to go for it, because let's, let's just face it, a lot of people... You can knock, knock on the door, me. someone's door, apparently. Yeah, I'm just going to highlight that as well, because Mandy might need a highlighting. Yeah. It See what they do, though. They, they publicly expose themselves when they just can't prove what they're well, saying. Well, Ginger, before. apparently you know, you're a good researcher. Yourself. Find where I live, yeah? Find where I live. Don't oh. ask me where I live. Just find where I live. You all are amazing researchers. Let's Come on. I will take away. Look because at I, her. Expose I, I, yourself. I we have <laughs> Antifa in the chat, guys. People Over Tommy Tards who are watching, are watching one of the front runners for Team yeah. Tommy <laughs> acting like an Antifa activist. Yeah, doxing people in a YouTube chat. Here we go, everyone. An easy free dox here that we didn't even need to post on Telegram about. Easy free dox. Mad, isn't it? They're literally getting off these heads, isn't it? <laughs> and we're just having chit chat over chit chat. Imagine yeah, what will happen when we start posting again. <laughs> I didn't realize that having a chit chat with three guys about everything kind of thing would be. Would upset someone like that. I mean, it's ridiculous. Well, so. she can get any guy, so you know, maybe she's jealous over you on know, Wendy. I don't know. Well, where's where's Mark Benfield? You know, he, he sent me a free threat to turn up at my no, work, and I turned up. I will tell you well, where he's he an, he's an ex heroin addict, and he's going well, with someone. I will someone tell you exactly. where he is. I will tell you where he is in his own words. I'm in the Come, come, to see <laughs> come to me. <laughs> He just pop into one chat. I just had, by the way, the chat where we was arguing uh, with Danny Roscoe, I just shut it down two days ago or yesterday. And it just was just... It's kicked off anyway. since then. Hey, yeah, it's, 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 it's like, if anyone wants to turn up at my door, it doesn't matter. The ring doorbell to take your call first. And then like, <laughs> <laughs> Be me too. prepared to have a camera on your face. Because no. yeah. <laughs> I'm not scared. I know every bit of law to come come for me. I I got I I got to so Ginger yeah, doesn't so understand. Much fun in twenty twenty four, this is uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it this year. I gotta put everything. Out Self defense play. laws and ain't uh, too bad if you know what you can and can't do. So you can so can. if you have listen when yeah. she, when anyone turns up to your door basically and you yeah. have door to the garden, you might have to make sure the door to the garden they are broken so you can open and run for the garden. So no, if anyone no, turns up no, to your no, front no, door, no, then no, you are no, you you can no. do whatever you want to do. Anybody have, if they have a reason to be there, right? Like if you've mm. invited them, like a postman, mm. milkman, yeah. anybody, yeah. they have what they call an implied right of their access. Yeah. Right? It's like anybody, you have a garden gate, they have an implied mm. right of their access. You have a doorbell or a knotter. Mm. You, you, yeah. Unless you have a sign stating this is private property, mm. you do not enter unless you're like, 
blah, yeah. blah, blah, blah. Anybody has the right to knock on the door. You mm. then have the right, if you don't want to speak to them, you have the right to ask them to leave them to move the property. Yeah. If they refuse to leave the property, you are allowed to use a reasonable force necessary. So it's a like for like force. So it's basically, come on, get off my property. So if they start resisting back on you, push on on you, uh, now I would just bag them, bag them straight to the beanbags. <laughs> well, <laughs> no, you, you, you have to read it, but you have to read. <laughs> You have to meet it like in in the same police guidelines, right? It is reasonable force. So yeah. if you're not back to the beanbag, it's in back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You, so you just push them out your gate. If they refuse, then you can use a little bit more. They still refuse. <laughs> Give yeah, me a little out. fucking out. scare. But they right. won't do nothing. They you post won't. it because they ain't going to do nothing. They won't leave paper trousers. So they're going to do it. It's all for My a show. My camera is always on. What well, what I'm finding hilarious is Dan Tarragon thinks I don't know what you said about um, Danny Jones clown. I mean that, yeah. that's hysterical. I, do. I, what, 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 what I said so bad. I, he just making it out. Then I said such a fucking bad thing, and he's just like I didn't say really nothing really. Yeah, I know what I know exactly what clown feels and thinks about that. About it's just things. I. It was referring mainly, basically, because they tried to interrupt me in that conversation debate, but they couldn't find anything against me. So they brought Danny Jones, Mandy, and I said, I don't care about them. I don't leave, need to give a shit about them. Talk to me, because obviously the allegations are about me. Just talk to mm -hmm. me. I will answer it for myself, not for them. I won't, I can't be responsible for anyone else, right? And that just making this up like this was, God knows what did happen in that chat. I, I do really invite everyone to watch uh, Ghost uh, Speaker Corner. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to watch it. Um, yeah. yeah. It, well, these really people, good, they don't like people that have different opinions that get on. Yeah. They don't want exactly. anyone with a different opinion yeah, to get exactly. on. Oh, you're not allowed to speak to him because he's this. You know, that was Ginger mm. Tony that was the main one pushing that on me. Yeah. You know, active Patriot, he's pro this, he's around Horos. You, you can't like him, you can't like him. You know, Joe Drayson, she's against, you know, the British veterans because she's into patriotic alternative lads. It's, it's like, wow. What, what are you trying to do? <laughs> yeah. So listen, 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 listen. That's even the funny what? thing. That's the funny thing. What she said. Now is that literally the comment which she said. So she alleging that in the past when she was actually talking to us, we said something about Wendy Wu about the baby Peter. But baby Peter actually pops out after we actually stop talking to her. So how her statement is actual and factual? <laughs> she literally, um, she literally messed up in here. Tony, you see, I, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but anything that anyone said about me, I, does it goes right over my head. I'm sorry, it doesn't bother me. Wendy, you're oh, such a horrible person. Wendy, you're such a horrible witch. <laughs> Ginger Tony, it's no, I left my head. ex. I don't care. You know what? I it's left my ex in London Tony because she was addicted to drugs me. with her brother and your your drug dealer, Paul Smith. I left and walked out on the ex because they were doing drugs around the children. Oh That's why God. I left the ex. So you keep bringing Ginger. up that I'm doing his Ginger, arm Ginger, pop in on the panel. Just pop in on the panel, I would destroy Ginger. you. Ginger. Ginger, I'm not being prejudiced because my wife's Ginger as well, and I know exactly how they can be. <laughs> because I've got a Ginger They're mental. They're, they're, they're fiery. I call her the Gua. She's a Ginger with attitude. Right, anyway. Anyway. Yeah. Pop, it, pop in and say anything to tell me. Yeah. Right? The reason why you contacted me out of the blue you when see? I called Dan Daddy Roscoe out for sniffing coke and the donation. What was what was so big? I, I you you haven't answered anything. Uh, come no. on, I want I want an answer there. Ha, what was little old Tyrant Finder? Right? What, what what was the difference between an eight hundred quid? Tommy Robinson gets fucking millions. Yeah. Like what, what was the difference? I will like answer. Because because I I was I'm a threat. No. I'm a threat. That's what I well, feel. You did you did question Danny Roscoe and Danny Roscoe was invention of Ginger and Tony. So Danny Roscoe was her in own invention. She put him into the place. She gave him gave him our project, which was the uh, one race, the human race, which we started with Glenn. So she recall it by the black and white united, and she actually guided uh, Danny Roscoe how oh, to do it, where oh. to do it. 
Hang on, can you put her next? Could you put the status up saying, please? I've just seen that. <laughs> yeah, can you put that up, please, and then I'll answer that. Because I ain't oh, afraid. Oh, the... It's because the... this, because that. Oh, my days. You are such a child, Ginger Tony. Because he did this. I'm going to do that. No, do you know why? No. Because you know why I put that up? Because I was fed up of you going on at a blind lady. Right? It was, it'd been kind to me that I see her as a nice, kind person. And I'm not having anybody like that that I see as a nice person because I stand up for anybody, left or right, because I'm for the people, me. I, I stood up for her and I said about Danny Roscoe. Hmm. Yeah. That's where it was your mistake. Yeah. All, That's where it was your mistake. All, all That's the golden up, boy. Coming out of that hotel, hmm. right? All coked up at the first Telford, Raper Britain, when he stood up on there and he's off his head. I'd done the job, I knew what to look for. You know, people come into right. my cells all the time, pinned up. You know what I mean? Talking I a million miles an hour. Question. You know what I mean? I've seen it all the time. Yeah. Can you ask a question? I've been has, around it. Has has any, I was around anyone, it. Listen, has anyone on this panel got a full set of teeth? Yes, Ginger Tony. It's me, it's Wendy, probably, you know. You never, you didn't see actually Andy now because he might actually have a full set of teeth. Uh, try and find it. But if you're asking this question, I would like actually point out then you have to take some of your teeth when you're actually eating the dinner so before you will i bring anything in just look at your own one uh, it's funny isn't it it's insult but yeah you've got tommy robinson who has a full set of false teeth but she haven't got full set of false uh, teeth <laughs> but it's how childish has, that they she, go to listen, it's she's, she's taking hey, some of hey, them hey, out i don't even have that i wish i would have loved to have that look i've got nhs dentures that i can't even wear because they're so cheap Shit, yet Tommy uh, Robinson's she... got thirty thousand pounds worth of teeth. Yeah, but yeah. she so has. She, I've got she has to remove them. I've been held by my voice. I haven't got no teeth in. No. Tiran, but it does no. not matter. She haven't got her own full set of teeth. She, she has to actually remove some of them when she's eating. I was in the restaurant <laughs> with her. She literally removed them and packed up into well, the tissue. Well, I lost my teeth <laughs> through cancer and things like that. And then she know, brings something like that. It's just but like why, why is she body shaming? Why does she need to go to the point of body shaming? You know, body how old shaming. Are you? Have You're you a mother. Her? So grow the fuck up and act like what? Have you and stop her? acting Have you like a little kid. <laughs> throwing your dummies out the pram. That's all Have you, you do. Her? Smear, 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 smear. It's she's all showing you've exactly got. exactly what goes on, isn't she, really? Because she's not answering anything important. She's just going personal at people. It's ridiculous. It's childish. Yeah, even yeah. if it's me and Wendy only, you still have a fake teeth, Ginger Tony, so you shouldn't brought this up against anyone because you haven't got full set of your own teeth. So just pointing out your hypocrisy. Just go get your, your life. Just do something with yourself. Get maybe I don't know. Just get some. Well, uh, you know what? The beauty, beauty, beauty shop. And... It's just well, I just I, I can't get it because the, all these people just like she's sitting in this chat for well, for good two hours now, and she just keep ranting, ranting, ranting. But she doesn't she want to come on on the channel. She doesn't want to come on, but she wants to expose us. She putting some funny videos, whatever, whatever, which she put in. But she doesn't want to face us. So she's the part of the the amazing team of the team Tommy, which they are best researchers and all that stuff, but none of them want to expose us. Uh, Danny Roscoe did promise one hour ago that he would pop in in half an hour. He didn't <laughs> pop in yet. He disappeared again. Uh, it's just all of them. They're just like in just weirdos. Absolutely weirdos. Well, I'm, glad, I'm, I'm glad she keeps asking me strange questions like, Wendy, have you heard my your have you heard your content? I think that's what that's meant to say. My content is none of your damn business. Because I'm not involved with you or Robinson or any of them, so I don't know what you're doing here, really. I mean, you're, you're if here. If she could, right? Like, if they could all come in here, right? And really, if they're for the people and all that, they could come down here and sit down and have an actual conversation about his, history and about you know how we. <laughs> You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah. No, no history, no history of them. <laughs> they don't know we history. Had, we had a chat yeah. called Resolve Your Conflicts, and they, a couple of them did come in there, but they only went in there to fight, throw accusations. They wouldn't resolve any conflicts with us. No. Uh, we've got the whole chat archive. Mm. Danny Roscoe, you got Hell Goa, you got even Ginger Tony's boyfriend jumping in there. You know, yeah. not one of them wanted to resolve a conflict with us or anything. You know, the chat was open for what, two, three months for Laura Nina? Hmm. And now Laura Nina, she got attacked. 
Oh, because she opened that chat up for Yeah, I'm telling you, it's like everyone that infiltrates groups here, like getting popular. It's like they're trying yeah. to infiltrate it. And I, yeah, it's it's just saying people tone. TR Robbins and Tommy yeah, Robinson. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, when he pops up, look. Jesus. Yeah, boom. A little lurker. Spies. Wendy, <laughs> you're getting spies. This is this is what we get on a daily basis. Oh, 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 oh. Danny, uh, Danny Roscoe wake up. Obviously, he was obviously spying. He wasn't out. He was sitting there listening. But he, did, he didn't <laughs> have a boss. Yeah. yeah. And he he said, we, yeah. Yeah. So his comment is, we decided to do what you do. Danny, come on do the live our, our stream oh, on our oh, panel. You oh, turn it Let's everything talk about your original, your original name, Scott Tomlin, and why you don't want to. And he's calling us a pussy. He said, pussy. Is the lot of you? Well, you promised to pop in on the stream, and you are actually afraid of popping in. They beg twenty twenty four is going to be a year that they're going to troll us as well. He's saying he I'm listening while oh, out. It's oh, yeah. mobile. You know what I mean? Well, that's, sad. Up, but... that's sad. If you've got nothing better to do, I start out to be listening. <laughs> <laughs> It is, isn't it? It is, literally is. When I went for holiday, right, now um, over the Christmas and the New Year, I literally had no time, no time to look into the Telegram, no time to look into anything. I put Maybe I check basically when I just come back to hotel or whatever, just, just put some few comments and that's it. That was, I literally had no time. I was enjoying my, basically my time, <laughs> with, basically my son and this and that. We've been climbing the mountains, we've been seeing my grandma and all that stuff. I literally have no time absolutely no time i don't know how i survived this holiday but that was me going out and i exactly. and him and he's out oh he's working oh he well, i'm he out be, working he shouldn't be listening on his bloody phone then he should be working oh he? roscoe you should you be working you know, yeah uh, um, you know, the masks are they're really good but the <laughs> masks the mask does mm. finally slip they do let that mask when they get like mm. yeah you know, you know yeah it, it, they're very narcissistic always want the line like danny you're never, you're never gonna get it, mate. You're not gonna get a YouTube following. Sorry, it's very hard no. to break into YouTube. Oh, it's hard to understand like what he says. You know time, why? Even when you, you know write why a I, sentence. Well, it, it's it's also what you're putting out. But you, what you got to remember, I only got, I wouldn't be as big as I am now. And you know, if if I didn't have lockdown or anything like that, it's mm. because it, it was a captive audience, and it's a proven fact that you had more of a viewership to your lockdown youtube figures went mm. up so you know he went into it at the wrong time because you know i didn't see you throughout lockdown mate where are you where was he in the brexit you know, stuff where was he prior to brexit yeah, i wasn't at brexit the I media. To, to be quite yeah, honest we got history was, of him being pro black lbg yeah but i i didn't weird, really this i really didn't know what he did I, I, I voted to leave you know what I mean? I, I, you know, but I didn't. You know, I voted for my own reasons. It was clear that you know we're we're being lied to. It, I advise everyone to vote leave, which is strange. It's, but I did advise you know, everyone to vote leave. We really got Brexit. <laughs> you know, our borders that, are still yeah. being flooded. It, it's that's a different Brexit in name only, isn't it? It's, you know, Theresa May only. signed the act with the United Nations with a compact deal after Brexit was voted. Yeah. That tells you all you need to know about our establishment. They yeah, legally we went into lockdown. And, you, you know what I mean? It's like, mm. but none of these talk about that. Well, yeah, exactly. Why well, are no we on this topic? Yeah, why we are on this topic? Uh, Daniel Roscoe is claiming he's doing so much for about the, against these uh, boats coming in, illegal immigrants, all that stuff. It's Tommy Robinson. Yeah, Tommy well, Robinson is saying, yeah, they're claiming, the immigration they're claiming, but got. they're not talking. They're not talking about the 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 true reasons why we have the problem. They're not talking about Theresa May signing this Marrakesh uh, UN uh, irregular immigration agreement. That's the reasons why we have this problem. They're not talking about the Brexit and the the, the fact that Theresa May, within the one month of actually vote for the Brexit, she literally sold out the country. Yeah, they're not talking about it. Why? Solutions don't pay them donations. Yeah, yeah it does. They don't, they don't want to say I found that out a long time ago. You know what I mean? If, mm. You know, you're not spouting what... I don't know if the lockdowns, people... Chris, you know? The, yeah. the lockdowns taught me a lot about people. Mm. You know, mm. half of them say they're awake. They're not. They're following someone. They're not awake. Mm. They're only following someone's agenda. Mm. And these Tommy Tards, I'm sorry to say it, I was once one. And I'm proud to say I was a Tommy Tard because I've come away from it. As hard yeah, as it is to you, you can't swallow the truth. Teacher. The truth you've is got, the truth. Yeah. You've got to like it or be called out. Exactly. Mm. Ginger, you can't threaten mm. me just by the way. 
just to I mean, add if to people can't comments. see in the chat that these people will not are not willing to debate us but are willing to smear us i mean that's the answer in itself yeah. What are they hiding? Why do they not want to answer our questions to why they are smearing us in the first place? Because they are not intelligent enough. That's the first thing. Secondly, they then, have no that are running with the smears. Why do they not actually research the smears they put out and find the facts? Because but you know, they can't, they can't, even if they will put the smears against us, they still can't discredit well, the so true, true fact control, what we provided control. against Tommy. Yeah. Who, who's the oh, if they want to, stuff, they can search back from my research. channel. And look at my uh, complete details. Have you seen what Danny everyone... Roscoe just wrote? Have you seen what Danny Roscoe just wrote? Trigger Why post, probably. Oh, hang on. Why Wait. you didn't invite us on the panel? Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's a he's a uh, Wendy. This guy have a literally problem with his brain. My God. He literally can't have that? a problem. Ew. He's on about someone to do with someone's brother. Like she's trying to intimidate by threatening about putting family members out. Danny, you see Danny, what he's saying? Danny, oh, he's Danny. saying beforehand. Danny. So you should invite them, send them an invitation letter. No, no, no. I did no, invite no. them. Danny. I posted the I link on I, my channel. I was, yeah, being ready for a live stream. Yeah, yeah, I posted the one. link on the channel too. I posted one, the Danny, Danny Rosco, I said to you, wait for a Wendy Wu stream. One day I'll be on there live. Feel free at any time you catch me on Wendy Wu's live stream is to pop on. Well, here we are. You've caught me on a live stream. You're more than welcome to pop on to answer the questions I have for you. And me. I have a problem with the words. Danny Roscoe, at least I know when the first world war started, when the first world war ended. I know exactly when the second world uh, war yeah. started and when it ended. I know exactly, you know, what was actually all about the world. And I know where you come from. So if you want to debate jump on let's debate we will start from where you come from <laughs> come on danny you said you didn't see your There's website everything on the internet about me everything I, I you know i'm very limited you know i've seen a few videos about you. it's clearly you are in these videos and pictures that i've seen you know i'm not any fucking idiot can see that, you know. His customers are more important. Were, your shoes were absolutely. <laughs> Listen, his customers like tonight so are come more on, important. Come on, and truthfully, honestly, <laughs> tell me, every time I've met you, you haven't been off your base on coke. <laughs> Look on his comments. Look on his comments. Have I given you enough content tonight to give you a bit your of Do You think? I don't think I have. I think it'd do you more damage if you put anything out about me. Hey, Tyrant, he's threatening. I think he's trying he, to threaten about where you... he said. <laughs> he said then his customers tonight are more important. Is he selling himself? It's Saturday oh, night. Frank, 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 ego, is ego. Ha! Where I come from? Yeah, because if you were of any sort of intelligence, Danny. You have, uh, you know, it's a Bristolian dialect. Is how we speak yeah. around here. Yeah. You say, "Where are you from?" Instead, instead of, "Where do you live?" Okay, you got to speak like him. Dialect. You're not allowed speaking in your own. So, local am, area. am I not allowed to speak with my Bristolian accent? Because if I actually spoke Grizzle, which I can speak a little bit of, because my grandmother, my grandmother taught me it, then you know, you, you know, I want, I, I will, you know, but attacking somebody for the way they speak i've got no teeth in my head at the moment i'm freely listen what she's saying to even he did it, it to me he slated me for being speak. scottish because scottish get free medication yeah. i was like yeah i'm working paying taxes for that in scotland so what's now, your problem with me being scottish ginger, it's like he's slating me because if you get paid by the british government i'm like listen <laughs> you fucking idiot andy See, the differences the differences of critiquing people Right, is you got a, you you've been to is it is it what's the name Karen's cat? Yeah, they draw a line on what you can and can't do. You can start attacking people's public your appearance of how they look or the way yeah. they talk. You know what I mean? You can't do that. This it's the same here. And not once have we have attacked people. You right? No, no. I have to. You know, I have to. Um, I'll have to choose my words because you're construed it out. I mean. Yeah, Tina. you know something um, differently. Um, you, you know, you come back with with how we look. Okay, if I said your shoes were shit, 
that's something you made, you created as shit. That's like my opinion of it. Someone might have thought it was brilliant, but that's my opinion of it. Mm. Didn't attack your appearance, did I? You know, and all the way you speak. Yeah, we're just. Um, so uh, Ginger Tony, she's trying the old tactics of division and basically she's trying to stick the wedge between me and Atina. She alleged and I told her a lot of stuff about Atina, so Atina should be careful. <laughs> Which Atina obviously obviously responded. Tony, Clan will freely admit he knows nothing about me. Yeah, that's the actually point. Ginger well, tried it for me with you. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. At, at the time when I was when I at the time when I was still speaking with with Ginger Tony, I did, she did not know nothing about him, Atina. I did know a bit more about Atina. Atina after I spo stopped speaking, speaking to her, yeah, but it's just like, Atina is right, maybe Ginger is just looking it, it's, for a shot. It literally is like being at school. Oh, I'm going to yeah. tell Ginger maybe, she yeah. said, like, well, don't trust Clown World, don't trust Clown World. It's like, why? Clown World was yeah. questioning oh, things about what they were doing. Oh, they told that to me, mind you. Yeah, 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 they <laughs> told that to me. When, when so was I know I started me. questioning Clown World, naturally, instinct. Yeah, it's like, yeah, why is she up against Clown World? Let's speak to him. They were telling me Ginger on the voice notes and on the messages and stuff like that. Was saying but she to me probably that pushed your not hate. intentions you're onto wanting hate. to know. Yeah. You see, Danny Roscoe comment. I knew she was trying to play me anyway from the start, so I didn't feel she, she does this to I'm people. I'm not afraid of getting back. That, to but these people right don't now. like people that think for themselves. They want to be on the forefront of people's minds. That's why they post stuff saying we know people can't stand your life. like. Hell, Girl says this all the time. She speaks for the people, not for herself. It's like you don't yeah. speak for the people, Helga. You know, why do you think you're so hierarchy? You know, it's like they're bragging because of their position with the EDL or Tommy Robinson. It's like you're yeah. just no different to who I am. You're born, yeah. you know, you're the soul of soul who sold yourself to the devil and doing what you're doing to protect your ego and your motives. You know, Danny, answer the question. question why did you put that video out or you was on somebody's live stream and saying I get 60 to 120,000 views? Her live, I wish I fucking did. Mm, you know, I see five, video. five, six, five, six k is the most, and I earn mm. thousands of pounds. Please answer that one. Also, can I, can Danny Roscoe say? I wonder what Tommy Robinson would it? think about seeing Ginger Tony I mean, with the comments he's put on here. I wonder what Tommy Robinson yeah, would think. Exactly. Yeah. What an embarrassing he's, he's watching this it. is. Probably he's watching. He's probably that. slapping anyway, his face, guys, thinking, I'm "Oh, he's on one." Down now because I, I got mm -hmm. got Yeah. Tim, I'm sorry. It's good to speak if, to if you. Tommy, if Tommy didn't have the likes of Ginger and that around him, he could have just made him a political partner. Quite, quite a good one that a lot of people would have followed. But I think it was muddy with the people he had around him and the people he chose to surround him with. But these people, people, you've got to have gatekeepers, haven't you? The ones in the lower echelons. And Danny, Danny Roscoe, sorry, mate, all you are the lower echelons. You are like the little, the little first gatekeeper you know that never goes away and you get the annoyance in the background yes ginger you've got permission carry on right and so, okay guys i'm going to shut this down now so sure. uh, well, it's good to, to speak over. to all of you and, um yeah ginger, just post it on your channel you know you like to post up on your channel <laughs> that's she has it channel. we can all see it Oh, no, 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 we can see it. it. We ban. We ban. We can see it. We ban. We have proven. You've proved. If, if nothing else, you've proven tonight what a coward. What cowards they are, um, mm. because they wouldn't come on and have a discussion, even though she did ask to come on. And then when mm. we said yes, she decided no. So, uh, and Danny Roscoe was has been given ample choice chances to come on to the stream. But then again, he's another one that's too scared. Well, so thank you, Wendy. I really appreciate thank this. Yeah, and thanks for that. No, sure. uh, thanks. And just let me just say let us one know thing. they attack. Okay. Right. Be, be, be big after you, Tara. Let me just leave this on with this one note. I didn't know until tonight, one hundred percent sure. You know that that they were going to come back, and if they haven't come back, and any, yeah, I know you're all for the shit. Wait for it to come and out this 2024 from me. <laughs> yep. Danny, any day, mate. Tyrone, right, thanks thank for you coming guys. anyway. Thank, thank you. Good Cheers, guys. Have a All good right, New Year. You, thanks for Wendy. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, Wendy, bye. So I'll say good night to the people in the chat that I know. <laughs> but I'm not going to say good night to anyone else. I can't. <laughs> No, thank you. 